What is up, YouTube? We are back with another Persona 3 Reload part. If you missed the last episode, you probably should go check that out because we made a lot of advancements with social links and some story stuff. We started getting a little bit of a look at some of Junpei's character arc. So last episode is definitely a must, uh, a must watch. And I also started instituting a new thing where I'm cutting out the grinding that I'm doing in the Tartarus. So let me know how you guys have been feeling about that. But on this episode, we have a few more days of social link stuff that we're gonna do, maybe increasing some of our stats like academics and shit. And then after that, it's gonna happen, boys. There's gonna be another full moon. So we're gonna get another advancement in the story and then also get ourselves a, uh, a, a new boss fight here. And, uh, you know, I fused a lot of personas at the la at the end of the last stream. So this is what we're rocking out with. Mainly these top four right here, Kukulin, Dakini, Thoth, and Black Frost are mainly the ones we're using. Um, but yeah, man. So let's go ahead and lock it in, fellas. And uh, let's go ahead and see what the rest of uh, this full moon is going to have for us here, boys. <clears throat> I thought I caught up to you while you were on a break, only to find out you're three months ahead. People in my Twitch chat are talking about trying to keep up with, uh, with how I'm playing this game as they're watching the streams. But, you know, you guys on YouTube hopefully are, are ahead of me. By the time you guys end up watching this, it's probably like three or four days after I've already done this. I can hear people talking. Good morning. Summer vacation is over. What a bummer. Why does life suck? Honestly, been there. Haha, <laughs> sounds like someone has apathy syndrome. Well, wouldn't life be easier if you actually did? What the fuck? What? No, do I really? On second thought, you're right. It doesn't sound too bad. At least I wouldn't have to worry about anything. If Omega didn't take two days off, you'd pro uh, I'd probably be in November. Low key, it depends because like my last session was like 12 hours of Persona. I could potentially be past November. I'm we might get to November in this stream. That's cat. That's cat. That's not gonna. There's no way that's gonna happen. But who knows? Anything's possible. Gotta go. Spoilers. Never gonna play. But I gotta. <laughs> can't see spoilers. I get it. Uh, everybody knows this one's resistance. What up, Yato? How you doing, bro? Banger song. November today is big cap. Oh, I see you're not familiar with my game. If I get to November today, you got to uh, give me your house. Okay, let's see. And as you, you guys also might notice that I went back to using my Xbox controller because if you guys have been watching the playthrough parts, you'll notice that my DualSense kept disconnecting and acting really weird on my PC. So I decided to say fucking just go back to Xbox. It is what it is, not my fault. L Sony, can we get some lonies in the chat? Inform students. I heard from my friend that there are going to be cafes and stuff at the culture festival. My club doesn't do that kind of stuff. It looks fun though. Those cafes and booths are so cliche. That's so dull. They need to have some kind of twist to them. I hope someone comes up with a crazy idea. I got a crazy idea. Put this gun to your head. <laughs> okay, let's, uh, wait. Do I have a Justice Archon or Persona with me? I'm sorry. I didn't want you to see me like this, but here we are. I was hoping we could walk home together. Is that okay? Um, wait. Let me go get a Justice Arcana, my kitten. You wait there for me, okay? Loney, even though it's my primary console. I got, I got. Um. Do, 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 do. Okay, I need to pull up. We can get rid of this. Uh, Justice Arcana here. Okay. <clears throat> Hello, Elizabeth. I am here to summon a Justice Persona. Uh, which one should it be, boy? Uh, there's power, principality, archangel. Uh, uh, I guess it doesn't really matter who I summon, right? I should just probably summon one that's cheap. Is this acceptable? Maybe just to get the uh, persona thing. It'd be interesting if like the more powerful of a persona you had, the more like uh, relationship points you got. Maybe it is like that, actually. Any knowers? Guys, I think Chihiro is madly in love with me. Um, 
Right. Right. Maybe she's madly in love with everyone. Never thought of that. She's madly in love with anybody that gives her attention. Nagasan, you came. I'm sorry. I didn't want you to see me like this, but here we are. I was hoping we could walk home together today. Is that okay? Oh, Drake's. Let's spend some time together. And we're about to get her to rank nine right now, me tinks. Uh, not me tinks, me no. I want to get away from the school as quickly as possible. Shall we get going? Stay there. Attention, please. Is money still a problem this far into the game? Not really. The student council president would like to speak with you. Please report to the student council room immediately. I repeat. Uh oh. The president wants to speak with me. Uh oh, chat. Don't tell me she thinks I stole the money too. Um. Um. Don't worry, she'll help us. Yes, you're right. She'll help us, won't she? I got you, baby. If I talk to her, at least I won't have to trouble you anymore. Wait, you can still trouble me. That's fine. Um, shall we head to the student council room then? Good. You're both here. I Mitsuru. for the sudden announcement. Okay. The reason I called you here is What is the reason? People are saying I stole money. That is the reason. Yes, that's right. I happened to overhear the rumors. First, I'd like to hear from you directly on whether you actually did it or not. Uh, um Miss President, I Why are you fumbling, Chihiro? You sound so guilty. Uh... Oh, she's looking at me. Chihiro is innocent. Senpai, no, I can't keep doing this. I need to stand up for myself. I, uh, I, I didn't do it. That sounded very convincing. Chihiro's lips are trembling. Well, I thought as much. Wait, she actually, Believe she me? thought so. Considering all the work you've been doing for the student council, I can't imagine you'd be the type to steal. I fully expected it to be nothing but a baseless rumor. I just wanted to hear it directly from you. Miss President, th thank you so much. That said, we can't expect everyone else to be as understanding. As you have seen, people are openly sullying your reputation because they don't know you as well as we do. I'll figure something out for the time being. That's my duty as the student council president. W. Mitsuru! Give me a hand, will you? Uh, all right. I'd like your opinion on how to proceed. You've spent more time with Fushimi, so you understand her situation much better than I do. I wish I could handle this right away, but I have other business to take care of. You don't have plans tonight, do you? Come to my room when you're available. Mitsuru. Right in front of my side girl? Like, you want to do this right now? Like, right in front of my side piece? Like, girl, I guess. Like, I'm going to have to do it. Like, and I'd prefer you try not to be sneaky. Oh, and I'm your sneaky link? Oh, say that. Wait, d d does that, does that mean... Oh, Chihiro, no. will be meeting alone? About you. About... It's for you. I'm not sure I understand the problem. If We're doing... If people get involved, it could draw unwanted attention. The two of us can handle this, so you... No, I can't allow that. Oh. Fushimi. Oh, wow. All I have to do is clear my name, right? I I can do something about it on my own. I'm going to... Wait, she a little jealous. Wait, Fushimi. Hold on now. I clearly remember what happened that day. You had a bandage on your chin because you cut yourself while shaving. I also remember handing the fee money to you directly. Or are you really going to say that this is my mistake? Yo, Chihiro with the W press. I'm not gonna lie, you getting cooked. Give me an explanation right now, or else. I'm so sorry. You're right. It's it's completely my fault. Oh shit. Well, Senpai has been. Wait, what? W press. The truth is, I accidentally took the money home with me. It 
Bro. I meaning to bring it back here, but then I uh, completely forgot. Bro, are you dead ass? What? What? It's just the payment deadline was pushed back, so I didn't think it was that urgent. Then I kept forgetting to bring it in each day, but I, I figured I'd get around to it eventually. And well, here we are now. How right. How could you? I know. This is completely my responsibility. I'll tell you what this man does, okay? He's an avid XQC viewer, right? And he wanted to get into gambling. That's all it is. He is he is just addicted to gambling. It, it'd be like that all the time. What up, Static Shock? Uh, I love this game. I'll make sure to explain everything. I'm sorry for the trouble. So there's the truth. I'm almost more dumbfounded than angry. How do you even call yourself a teacher? Damn! I'm so sorry. Getting pressed by these little jits is nasty work. Anyone trying to interlock toes? Hey, do it up. You're going to forgive him? You almost ruined your reputation, Chihiro. You should kill him. Let's go, Senpai. Senpai, over here. Can you believe I went to the faculty office and said all that? I even surprised myself a bit. This whole thing is just... <laughs> Uh, why is she laughing like that? What's gotten into you? <laughs> Come on, can you blame me? <laughs> Remember when I said I can't allow that for the student council president? Uh, yeah. It's just when I thought about you and Miss President being alone in a room together. Oh, were really mad at you? You did. Of it. Oh, you did. Chihiro has a refreshed smile on her face. I feel like our relationship has grown. Rank up. Rank 9 Justice. I've been like that ever since I was little. Or so my mom said. She wants me so bad. Normally I'm quiet and timid, but when it comes to something I care about, I get really aggressive. Wait, so you care about me? It's because I uh, um Hi. Yes. There's something I want to say to you. What do you want to say to me, Chihiro san? Actually, I've wanted to say it for a while. I didn't think I had it in me. But I think I can do it now. I better choose my words carefully here. Senpai, I I love I love you. Or I can be a slut. Damn, like that's crazy. Like I was finna say the same thing, baby. Like I really love you too. Like, oh my god, like I love you. What did you say? I love you. Oh, I'm so happy. W. Feels like something out of a manga. Yeah. Don't worry, baby. Once I get my social link to 10 with you, I'll never speak to you again. Lose my number. I've entered a special relationship with Chihiro. There's no going back now. Oh, I still have to apologize to the student council president. Um, is it okay if I ask you to wait by the school gate? Yeah, that's fine. For us to be able to go home together. Yeah, for sure. I got you, baby. <laughs> After speaking with Mitsuru, we headed back home together. I ended up getting home a little later than usual. Are you Persona hoeing? What? Me? What? I I detest oh, that. There he is. I would never do something like that, chat. Whew, that does it for our first day back. Well, you two have perfect timing. Perfect timing? For what? Hey, Fuka! Is I guess ready? What's she doing? Hey! This is 
how I look now. Huh? Why is she wearing a school uniform? What's going on here? She looks good in the school uniform, too. She said she wanted to go to school with us. So I told the others as a joke. She really do got she that shit on, huh? Agreed, so now she's going to start as a second year tomorrow. Seriously? He's down with that? He said something about studying her behavior in a social environment. Mm. Sounds like him, all right. Well, if he's cool with it, then I guess it's all right. Besides, I'd say it looks pretty good on her. Maybe even you. The school camouflage that Fuka-san provided is more than appropriate. It looks very natural on you. No one will suspect a thing. Shut the fuck but up, Ken. Why do you want to go to school? It's not like it's interesting. Is Ken going to be my new bully target? I have to bully somebody every Persona game. Efficiency. If I remain here on standby, it could affect our deployment efficiency. To accommodate, I requested reassignment alongside our squad. Yes, lay off of Fuka. Leave Ken alone. Oh, man. Why do I feel like you being at school would make that even worse? I will make any necessary adaptations as the situation evolves. Uh, sure, you do that. He says, I want to go to school too. W. Coro. Coromaru. No, you definitely have to stay here, okay? All right, we got a box on the counter. W's. Okay, what do people do today? Tanaka? All right, so I guess we're just going to get some of our... Uh, I guess we're going to get some of our stuff up. So dance. Okay. Uh, hold on. I had my mic muted. <laughs> okay, let's see. Do we have uh, academics here today? God. Uh, I'm going to get really angry. And then you're not going to like what you see in the mirror, bub. What? All right. Um, Forget I said that. Okay, let's go to a uh, remix. Hey. The cafe is urgently seeking workers. We do not care. What Katsuki... I'm gonna have to go study like a broke bitch, chat. No. No. Say it ain't so. I have to go study like a broke bitch. I have a recommendation. What is your recommendation? Go to the shady motherfucker at the club. You're talking about the guy with the URL stuff? I already bought all the stuff off him. I've already done that, bad boy. The Temperance Arcana? Oh, wait, I forgot about this. Real. This would have been so good if I had the uh, arcade, though. Damn, still not level five yet, huh? It's okay. We still got, we still got some. I'm, we're definitely hitting max uh, academics before uh before we need it so we're, we're fine we're fine no coping okay we're gonna be just fine i see this must be tartarus during the daytime it's school right now i see i shall record that in my memory bank what up trespass i got something else for your memory bank class we have another new transfer student joining hey my sorry miss toriyumi my bad. Go ahead and introduce yourself. My name is Igis. I am pleased to meet you all. Igis, so? I've never heard a name like that. Maybe she's a foreigner. Let's see, anything else I should know? Hmm? Humanoid tactical weapon. What? Uh, clearly that's a mistake. It just goes to show you can't believe everything you read. Yeah. Right. For sure. Let's see. You can sit. Um, 
Are there any open seats? There's one on my face. Oh, there's a spot right next to him. Okay, off you go. I got a tactical weapon too. What is it, bro? Someone already sits there. He just ditched today. Which means he's not here. So now it's yours. All right, take your seat. The spot is perfect. My highest priority is to be with him at all times. Chat. Everybody need them in I guess, bro. What is it? Uh, Yukari, why do you stand up? Uh, why? Uh. Good to see everyone's getting along so well. But do me a favor and save the drama for after class. <coughs> If you say so, girly pop. Why does she do that? Because she's jealous that I guess wants me. It's a message from Sonata. I have something important to take care of after school, and I want you to come along. I'll be waiting by the front gate. Meet me there. Okay. Class has ended. I could have hung out with Yukari today, too. Fuck. I just want to start that social link already, man. I've got an errand I want you to help me with. Let's go. All right. I haven't even started Yukari's social link yet. You're really starting to piss me off. Things have changed. Sorry, but I'm not taking no for an answer this time. What? This belongs to you. <sighs> There's a new threat. Persona users just like us. <sighs> so? That's not my problem. That's not everything. Amada has joined our team. Oh, shit. <sighs> the hell do you mean he has the potential and ikutsuki san approved it he's a persona user now i don't believe it <sighs> tell me one more thing was it his decision to join yeah he came to us i see <sighs> then i guess i'll stick around so you're in charge now, huh? You got a problem with that, buddy? What are you fighting for? Mm. For my own sake. I see. Well, you do you. We gotta work together either way. My old room's still empty. He's coming, chat! Shinji's here! Let's go! Yet another new ally has joined. Shinjiro Aragaki. Yo, Blue Jay, thank you for the five gifted subs. I appreciate you, gang. Arigato, thank you, thank you, my brother. He's a year older than me and seems to have lived in the dorm before. Though shrouded in mystery, he seems to be a reliable partner. Hooray! Uh, what do people do today? They may have no nighttime social links. I could read with Igis, but I need to get my knowledge up. Actually, I'll read with Igis if this is not academics. Hooray. <clears throat> you went to the security website then? I have not done that yet. Come on, level up, level up. Fuck. Dude, the academics is taking so long. Okay, we're almost to the full moon now. Good morning. This is Elizabeth. I am calling to inform you that more humans have wandered into Tartarus. One this time, I believe. Please swiftly and safely conduct a search and rescue. Remember what I said in the last episode, chat? 
If anybody else wandered into Tartarus after I cleared it, you remember what I said, chat? Too bad. Die. Hello. A news report stated that the number of cases increases just before a full moon. It looks like there are more cases than last month. This is the highest it's ever been. Hmm, why is that? I'm sorry. I I'm not sure yet. I only hope that we're able to put a stop to this. Anyway, we'll just have to remain alert at all times. Yukari social link up, chat. Let's go. What if it's a social link? Can that even happen? Hey, so... Oh, she wants to talk to us in private. Sure. Thanks. Hey, so... Um... <sighs> Never mind. Just forget about it. I guess saying that only makes you more curious, huh? Yeah. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Sorry about that. So, you might have forgotten all about this, and it's totally fine if you did. But when we were at Yakushima, I said some stupid things. Aww. And I just wanted to say I'm sorry. It's been on my mind this whole time. <sighs> You know, I always felt like I wanted to just be normal. I wanted to have a family like all the other kids. Mom and dad to come home to. <sighs> Why do we have to be different? Why us? Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to lump the two of us together. But I feel like you understand and have been looking out for me. Of course I have. <laughs> <laughs> Is that just wishful thinking? <laughs> That's how I really feel, though. Yukari is opening up to me. It seems the two of us have gotten a little closer. Finally! Hooray! The lover's arcana! Rank up! We're finally rank one with Yukari Takeba! It's getting cold. Let's go home. Let's. I decided to go back to the dorm. Oh, you're back. Hey, I haven't introduced myself, have I? Name Shinjiro Aragaki. I stayed here before. I won't bore you with all the details, though. Anyway, long story short, I got your back. Um... There's going to be a full moon the day after tomorrow. I'm sure another large shadow will appear, so... Or so. <laughs> Please make sure you're fully prepared. I'm chilling in my bed. Okay, let's see. Who's missing? Reiko Makita. An office security reported her missing. She was working overtime the night before. Well... Doesn't seem like anybody important, so they can die. Hooray! W death. Academics? Question mark? Charm. Okay, you can cook with Araga. Oh, no, wait. I fear... I fear we cook with Shinji. Hey, I want to use the kitchen. Are there any rules about sharing ingredients and dishes we can use? Stuff like that? I want to hear more about the kitchen rules from you. I'll return the favor. Looks like Aragaki wants to use the kitchen. Should I spend time with Aragaki? Or are you busy? Uh, let's go to the kitchen. Yeah. Hooray! Not my problem, that's how I feel. So if there's leftovers, we can keep them in the fridge. But we're cooking for two today. There probably won't be leftovers. Oh, I forgot to mention, but I'm making katsudon. Make w sure cook? All, no matter how it tastes. Uh, 
You're making it? I said I think you did, not I? If you don't want it, I could put the meat away. But that's a pain, so just eat it. All right then. Time to get started. The rice is already cooked, so just scoop everything into a bowl once it's ready. I like extra large portions, by the way. W fat fuck? Yo, W wide back? I watched Aragaki cook. His skill is on par with that of a professional chef. The katsudon is ready. He's he's like that? Crunchy, flaky, breaded pork topped with half-cooked egg. I could eat this all day. He's a W chef. Like you're a fan, huh? Anyone can make this, as long as they practice. Today we just had the rice and toppings. But you could add side dishes too. Well, give it a try when you have time. Exquisite katsudon. All right. I did my part to thank you. You handle the cleanup. See you around. <clears throat> Persona makes you want katsudon. Persona makes me want a lot of things. Like a bullet to the head. Morning. Sup, dude? There's a full moon tomorrow. Hey, did you hear? The number of cases around town have gone up like crazy these days. I've heard. There are only four of those large shadows left. Maybe they're getting desperate? Or maybe the next one's just insanely strong. Oh, whoops, my bad. <laughs> I shouldn't jinx it. Anyways, we can handle it this time, too. Oh, whoops, just punched my mic. Mama? Yo, Chidori. How's your hand doing? What the? There's no scar. Not even a mark? Maybe it wasn't that bad? <sighs> Say, Junpei, what do you do to make yourself feel alive? Oh, she's super depressed. You'd love to see that. Breathe, I guess? You know, I can't say I've ever thought about it. How about you, Chidori? Is that how you feel when you drop? I don't know. Most of these are just scribbles. I don't really understand myself. Oh, huh. Hmm. To tell you the truth, there is one thing that makes me feel alive. It's when I sort of uh, get to play the hero, I guess. He's got a hero complex. In the darkest hour, unknown to all but a few, the chosen ones stand against the forces of evil. Our hero, Junpei. Fights to protect the world from these terrifying monsters. <laughs> well, you get the idea. That's when I feel most alive. Um, this is the part where you're supposed to laugh. So, do you fight all alone? <laughs> hey, I was just kidding around. You fight during a time that no one is aware of, right? That means no one knows what you've been doing. Mm. So you're fighting even though you'll never get any recognition for anything. I'm impressed. I guess I misjudged you. Uh, really? I didn't think you'd actually believe me. Can you tell me more? Wait, she's interested in you. You're kind of the weird one. Hmm. I guess it's okay, but you're sworn to secrecy. Got it? Mm hmm. So, there's this special power called a persona, and that's what we use to defeat the monsters. Okay, luckily, like with Shidori, it's not that bad, but this is why you can't trust the, the desperate motherfucker on a team. You feel me? Because, like,. Like, a, a motherfucker will leak your whole operation to the first girl that gives him any interest. Like, that pillow talking shit be for real, man. But not everyone can use a persona. That's what I meant by the chosen ones. If a girl is interested in me, I'm spilling top government secrets. Honestly, me too. <laughs> me fucking too. My friends are fighting too. And not to brag, but we haven't lost a single fight since I joined. Sounds like a lot of fun. If you haven't lost a single fight, that must mean you're really strong. Yeah, sorta. 
I guess you could kind of say I'm the leader. Oh. Oh, he taking plays out of the Omega Pro playbook, I fear. I mean, without me, things would just fall apart. I gotta tell everyone what to do and stuff, you know? It's a lot of work being in charge. Thank you, Junpei. I had a lot of fun today. You, you did? Look at him blush. He fumbling. For me to go. I'll see you tomorrow, right? <laughs> see you tomorrow, huh? Yes. All right, who can we hang out with? Oh, we can start Fuka's as well. All right, chat, let's start Fuka social link now. Should I cut my hair today or wait until tomorrow? I also need to cut my hair. All right, chat, we're gonna see if Fuka's social link is actually good. Oh, Nagakun, are you busy? Also, if you happen to be a little hungry. I have time. Oh, good. In that case, would you do me a favor? I was hoping you could taste the lunch I made. <laughs> to be honest, I don't have very much confidence in my cooking, but today I think it turned out okay. Yo, W Fuka voice. I've got a bad feeling about this, but I have enough courage to try it. So, will you taste it? Yeah. I bet. Sorry, I know you probably aren't very hungry. This is about to be ass, isn't it? Also, I think I have done Fuka's social link and I'm just now remembering what it is. I'm pretty sure she gives us like fucking food poisoning. It seems I have no choice but to eat it. I used vinegar as a base for relieving fatigue and then added a bunch of citrus. That sounds horrible. Just some simple light flavors. Simple light flavors. Um right. It has a very impactful flavor. It tastes horrible. I thought you might say that. <laughs> Thank you, though, for being honest. Actually, you don't look so well, leader. She literally gave us food poisoning. Oh, no. What do I do? Um, I'll go get some water. Wait right here. Fuka, my absolute queen. This is your queen? Like, you letting her kill you? Wait, don't answer that. What if your girl cook for you type shit, right? And then she give you Sam of Nella and now you shit in blood. That's just cool with you? I'll see you back at the dorm. It was worth it. Man, this is why men are the worst. But wait, for Mitsuru, I might be willing to do a lot. I'm sorry, Ken. I am shooting myself in the head before I'm hanging out with you. <clears throat> I could read with Fukachan. I might do that. That might get me some knowledge, right? What are you doing? Uh, this will get us academics. So we can do this. Uh, yeah, I read them quite a bit. Oh, wow. I guess it's good that I invited you today, then. <laughs> Dumbass can't even tell that I'm lying to her face. She's too precious, man. She's, like, too innocent. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt while you were reading. If you don't mind, can you let me know your thoughts once you finish it? Oh, I didn't notice the time. How far did you get? Wow. You read that much already? Yeah, I'm kind of that guy. I made a lot of progress too. Was I more focused than usual or? 
I feel like my academics have improved thanks to the skillful expression in the writing. Okay. Fuka has still failed to interest me at all so far. Um, if you don't mind, do you think we could read here again sometime? I sure. Reading was only a solo activity, but now I think reading with someone helps me immerse myself deeper into the fictional world. I'm here whenever I can spare the time, so come by if you can. I'd be happy to have you. All right, that's enough for today. Good night. All right, chat, tonight's the night. Full moon time. Um, the second semester just started and there's already another full moon. I wonder what kind of shadow will appear this time. You can count on me, Giga Chad. Uh -huh. I will. We all rely on you, actually. I can only provide support behind the scenes, but I'll do my best so all of you can fight with confidence. After school. All right. It's time, chat. Let us lock in. Man, Joy wasn't at the station today. This be me. Like, remember when y'all used to put on your best fit at school type shit? And then your crush didn't even show up to school that day. So now you have a wasted fit. That shit used to be the worst, man. Maybe I should check again. On second thought, I better stay put. The operations tonight. Hmm. And you know you got that shit on when you when you get up to like sharpen your pen. You know you don't even got a pencil. You get up to use the the pencil sharpener in the beginning or in the front of the class. You can just do your little walk. You know what I'm saying? Take shit. You know you had that shit on. When it comes down to it, we're fighting to protect her too. Wow, thinking about it like that kind of fires me up. Maybe we really are like heroes of justice. All right. Don't move. Oh? Huh? Wait. That voice. What happened to Junpei chat room? Tonight marks the sixth full moon. Have you found the shadow? Yes. It's near Polonia Mall, I think. For some reason, I can't quite pinpoint its location. I'm trying to narrow it down, though. Is that part of its power? Sorry, I'm not really sure about that either. What are you sure about, Fuka? We have enough to go on. Amada, did you find him? No, I can't find Junpei-san anywhere. His backpack isn't here, so I don't think he's been home yet. What is he doing? He knows tonight's a full moon. I'm not picking up a signal anywhere near the dorm either. Should I take more time to look for him, just in case? No, it's okay. You're young. Sometimes you just get in one of those moods. For now, though... We need to focus our attention on the shadow. But he could, Junior Bay could be in danger. We can't afford to waste any more time. We need to get moving. Let's go. Hold up. Did Junpei say anything about this? Hmm. Not that I remember. search for it there's no time to lose <clears throat> wait please i can do it this is what i'm here for well we need you to have a breakthrough then come on fuka the movement of the earth through your fingertips hear the answer of the wind flow through your hair what is she saying the knowledge of the water on your lips tell me lucia what 
that shrouds me from the truth. Hey, is she okay? For real, she tweaking. Don't break her. The beam kicked in. This is some kind of web beneath us. A web? Perhaps it's related to the old power cables underground. Back when the island was still being developed, this is where the main power station was located. Underground cables? Yes. A large number of power cables remain underground in a sprawling network, much like a web. W, I guess. So that's what's interfering with her ability? Thank you, I guess. I figured it out now. It's not that the cables are interfering. The cables themselves have been possessed by the shadow. They what? So everything under our feet is part of the shadow. No wonder you couldn't pinpoint it. It's covering this entire area. H how are we supposed to beat something like that? <sighs> Adding underground, huh? Junpei! What up, big facts? It was to sneak up on you. Is the rest of your team as oblivious? Damn it. I can't fight back like this. This isn't funny, Chidori. I want you to do something for me. Yes, Mama. I have orders for you to pass along to your team. You can at least communicate with them, can't you? My team? Orders? Do as I say. And you won't be harmed. All you have to do is call off your operation. Easy, right? And not just the one tonight. All of them. You want me to cancel the operation? No way. You're not one of them, are you? Strega. Quit wasting time. The shadow controls a whole underground network. The person I left in the Tartarus is just like, Hello? Can anyone hear me? <laughs> is anyone gonna save me? This is a problem. We have no means of attack. Your notes from previous battles mentioned a shadow that was able to take control of the monorail. I'm guessing this shadow must have its own body, just like that one. Let me see if I can pinpoint it. Luca. <sighs> Even if we know where it is, we still have to get to it. Mm. If it's abandoned, there may still be a way to enter the facility where the cables converge. We'll see. <sighs> I found it. All right, lock in. Good shit, Fuka. chamber underground it's rectangular so i assume it's man-made is it some sort of basement wait a minute i overheard the manager of escapade a while back he was saying the power supply has been acting up lately there was a big outage because of it that forced him to cancel some important event an outage yeah Mentioned they remodeled the basement into a control room a while ago. Maybe we should take a look. That's gotta be it. Good job, Yamagishi. All right. As soon as we're ready, we'll make our move. All right. Your boss called you in today to tell you you're doing a good job. I hate when they do that. It made me think I messed up somewhere. <laughs> what a troll. Hold on. I want to see something. I've actually never used Shinji. What does he have exactly? Oh, he's physical. Holy shit, he's got so much strength. Consumes HP to increase critical rate and physical attack of next damage. Damn, he looks, and he has no weaknesses. Damn, but I really like my party setup right now. Hold on. Oh, let me check what his theurgy is. 
Oops. Deveal, uh, deals severe strike damage to one foe. Once his HP is less than half, his determination ignites. What if I bring him instead of Akihiko? So the team would be me, Yukari, and Koromaru. I might do it for just this fight. It's going to suck because he's not going to get... Because Akihiko is going to miss out on this experience. But he'll only be behind by like one level. Let's see. He's damn 6,000 experience for his next level up. Yeah, I don't think I could ever get rid of Yukari. But I've just never used Shinji. So I really want to try him out. Hopefully he doesn't sell me in this fight though, <laughs> but we'll see. Yes. Are you ready? Let's go. Please be careful out there. That's the shadow's core. The cables are feeding into his body, so it might use electricity. There is Jar Jar. Please be careful. But it's a it's like a chance encounter as far as I'm aware. Huge shadows. Huh. Well, not like it changes what we usually do. The small shadows are kind of the hermit. Watch out for attacks that use electricity. Okay, so. I am going to increase our defense. I'm going to decrease their accuracy. The only thing that I really liked is that Akihiko had Tarunda, which is really strong. Okay. Okay, critical rate and physical strength way up. Wow, that takes away a lot of his HP. Wait, did I use, did I give us an attack? No, I should have given us defense, right? How do I see what my, isn't there a way to see like what your stats are at right now? Yeah, okay, attack. Okay, I give us all attack. I thought I did defense, but I'm an idiot. Okay, this is fine, though. Oh, let me, uh... Could I stand on this enemy? All right, perfect. I'm gonna use charge. Let's diorama the goat. Okay, watch the crit. Right. Okay, watch the crit. 500. Watch the crit. <laughs> that did a lot of damage. The enemy shadow is charging a lot of electricity. We should probably guard. It might be up to something. I'll analyze it on my end as well. I'm imagining we just guard this, right? Oh, Dakaja. Okay, so it's a two turn charge. Okay, now we actually have to guard. Cause that's useful to note for next time. Oh, 
Oh, it just gets stronger by doing that. Okay. Okay, so I think I actually do want to increase our defense now that it's powered up. Okay, we're gonna use Secunda again to decrease its accuracy. And then also that also decreases its evasion, which is another really good thing. Um, I'm gonna use another revolution with Koro. Get some of these crits up. And I think with Shinji, we're gonna bloody charge again. And hopefully he just doesn't die here. He definitely dies here, doesn't he? He's shocked. I think I have to potra him or something. Okay. Um. I think I have to like potra him or buy Sudi. Okay. Thank God I have Meteorama. That's very clutch. Okay. Now chat, watch this. Ready? Crit. Get him, Koro! Damn, Koro, you're kind of weak. Okay. Okay, so chat. I have Bloody Charge enabled, which increases crit rate and my next physical attack, right? And I have Revolution with uh, the dog. This should deal mad damage and hopefully it also crits. Let's see what his theurgy looks like. Wow, that did nothing. Oh, there's another attack? Maybe? Okay. <gasps> that did over a thousand by himself. He did over a thousand by his fucking dolly. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Hold on. Shinji is kind of my fucking goat. I feel like I just bloody charge again. Dude, bloody charge is so good. Okay, now Koro, could you please get a crit yourself? Okay, Koro was not the wave to bring here, I fear. This thing has, like, not hit a single fucking attack on me. Okay, we're going to use charge. Like, just using charge and shit like that is probably just better than using Theurgy. Uh, but I couldn't... I can't Theurgy right now. With her. Would Kuro's Theurgy stack? Wait, does that stack? Any knowers? Let's try it out. Fuck it. Let's see. Nah, I tried. Ah, fuck. I right, saw. So I'll, I'll hold on to his uh, theurgy then. Ooh, nice fucking crit. He crits when the effects of revolution run out. This fucking guy. Five hundred and nine damage. Holy shit. And we stopped it from charging up. Mazio. Who got shocked? Koro. Mm. 
Okay, I'll just uh, bust with gem or whatever. Here we go. And I don't have to charge actually with uh, with Shinji because I'm going to just use uh, Koro's theurgy here to give everybody double uh, physical. It would be so dope if that stacked, though. You're done for. Little calm 500. <laughs> Broke that real fast. Okay, so we can go ahead and Secunda up. This thing is just tanky as hell, man. Holy. All right, revolution up. Okay, I fear if I use bloody charge, I'll almost be dead. So I'm not going to use bloody charge this turn. Mazio. The weaves. Okay. I could go for this. Nah, then Koro's turn will be wasted. I was thinking of hitting them with the freeze so that way uh, Shinji can get a crit. Well, that might not end up being worth it in the long run. I'll just use charge here. Okay, and now I can use Diorama on Shinji. Heal my boy up. Let's get it. W heals, W heals. Okay. Get Sui! Use a crit! Wow, wait, 480? Oh, because he had he still had his own ability activated. That's right. Okay, I feel like I just bloody charge here every time. And now I should get my Theurgy? No, I lied. Okay, Torrent Shot. <laughs> that did so much damage! That might have been close to 1,000. It was either 800 or 1,000. Holy! I fucking love this game. This game is so satisfying to play. Like, once you start doing some broken shit, like, oh my god, how do you not love it? Wait, do I have a revolution up? I don't remember. Yeah, dude, Kakolin is so fucking good. Oh, it's time. This is gonna deal another thousand right here, I think. Hold on, chat. Shinji is actually so good. Oh, it was slightly less than a thousand. It was like nine hundred. This is different from how it's been charging up till now. It's powered up significantly. Everyone, hang in there. Hermit is about to discharge. We should probably guard then. And I'm gonna switch to Thoth for the guard because I'm assuming he's about to use a thunder move. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this and just guard. <clears throat> just to be safe. I'm afraid it's time I play Persona. It is definitely time you play Persona. Okay. Dang, that was with a guard, too. Fuck, that, that did a lot. Okay. Uh... 
All right, Mataru Kaja with Kukulin. Give us all some attack. All right, Meteorama. Let's heal us all up. W's. Meteorama is so good. Uh, Revolution. Oh, he missed on the crit. Well, he's going to use Bloody Charge anyways. Damn, Shinji almost died off of that. Mm. Oh, Kukulin is about to hit really hard next turn. <laughs> Kukulin. I wish, I kind of wish um, Yukari's uh, Theurgy was like a party. I kind of wish she had a Cadenza. Like, you know how the main character has the, conden the Cadenza uh, Theurgy? I low-key wish that was Yukari's. This is about to deal a lot of damage. Quick little 530. Look calm 530. No way I got hit by shock. Oh wait, I recovered. That's light. Now die. Oh, he's almost dead. Can you use charge Shinji? Or does it not stack with charge? Wait, what do you mean? Like, can I charge Shinji with bloody charge as well? Like using Koro's thing? I don't think it works like that. All right. I do not want to get rid of Shinji on my team. <laughs> He's so fucking good. He, I think, I think Shinji is good for boss fights, but if you're doing Tartarus floor climbing, he might not be good for that. Actually, I don't know. He does do a lot of fucking damage. I don't know. He just, he just seems really good. Oh, by the way, I think I sensed Junpei Kun earlier. He's back at the dorm, but something fell off. If you like Shinji, you'll like Junpei. You think so? We should hurry back, just in case. I low-key feel like Koro, like the revolution was nice, but I don't, I think Koro is replaceable. Like maybe Yukari, Junpei, Akihiko, or uh, Yukari, Shinji, Akihiko. What? You can tell? I see it. Through Mizia's eyes. Yeah, because you do have to heal him a lot, for sure. My friend. Hidori? That's not important. Why didn't you call off the operation? Is your mission worth your life? Dying is what people fear the most. Not me. Not? Well, I have never actually given anyone orders before. They he lied to you. Me. Even if I tried. You see, uh, I'm not really the one in charge. So, you were lying earlier? Men lie, Chidori. Get over it. I don't understand. Hey, can you tell me one thing? Was it all just an act? Chunpei. Hmm? The way we met at the station, that cut on your hand, the drawings. Were you just setting me up? Now that I think about it, a real cut wouldn't have disappeared that fast. <laughs> I see how it is. That was... Junpei! They're back already? An evoker. She's a person. Does she put it under her chin? Is that where her evoker is? Does she dead ass go like this? That's kind of gas. Medea. W Junpei. No, give it back. 
sorry, but we can't let you use this. What's all the fuss of... What? When did she... I guess restrain her. Understood. Uh, Chat, am I crazy for this? I think after I play this game, I want to buy a PlayStation Portal so I can play my PS5 version of Persona 3 Reload and do a whole new save on my PlayStation Portal while I'm taking a shit and while I'm laying down in bed. Now, the PlayStation Portal's got to be a scam, right? There's no way that thing works. I didn't even sense her until now. This is the only thing I can do. And yet, even we couldn't sense her. She must have the ability to conceal her presence. I certainly didn't have the slightest. Like, if, if I do another playthrough and I just skip through all the, like, cutscenes and stuff, it surely couldn't take me that long. I have a number of questions for you. Are you a member of that group called Strega? Uh, I'm not afraid of dying. Chidori? Chidori? Yeah, I'm. It looks like she's too emotionally unstable for an interrogation. Let's. She just like me. After she's had some time to calm down. I'll go ahead and arrange a hospital room for her. She'll have to be placed under watch, but I'm sure she understands. Chidori. Now I would still increase all my stats and social links and stuff, but. Like, I would just, like, fast forward through all the dialogue and stuff since I had just seen it. So that way I can do, a, a like, a New Game Plus save file without having to play my PC version. What up, Yagami? I'll ask you one more time. Is Chidori your real name? <sighs> what kind of organization is Strega? Are there others besides you three? <sighs> hey, hey, Junpei, you're not supposed to be here, remember? Junori! Junpei! <sighs> Sorry, he wouldn't stop asking about where she was. How are you feeling? Looks like you calmed down now. Aww. <sighs> she certainly has. In fact, she won't say a word. Maybe we should confiscate her sketchbook, too. Come on, you don't have to go that far. Taking that away isn't going to make her talk. I'm not so sure. She was quite upset when we took her evoker. Speaking of which, where did you get your hands on that? Medea. Didn't I tell you not to bring that up? What else am I supposed to do? I'll have someone else try next time. Why? Why did you take her from me? Dia. Takeba, call a nurse. We're done for today. I'll let Ikutsuki san know we're having difficulties. Oh, okay. Come on, Junpei. Let's go. Chidori. Aww. Meet Suru's trash at interrogating. We've all been there. There's no school today. It's almost time for the home shopping show. I got to a big story moment. I almost cried low key. Oh, really? Oh, chat, it's Sunday. You know what that means. Anything good here, Tanaka? All right, whatever. I wish Fuka would interrogate me like this. Bro, Fuka would have a panic attack trying to talk to somebody that she's supposed to be interrogating. <laughs> I feel like Fuka would not be a good interrogatist. Do I have a Sun Arcana with me? Nope, we gotta go summon one. Akinari san, we're coming! Why do you need Max Kurtz to even approach her then? Uh. Because she's like so much of a of a coward that like you gotta like be exuding that confidence. That shit. Marvelous. W Twilight Fragments. How may I assist you? This is your progress so far. You just did the October new moon? 
not that far away from you, boy. Wait, what am I looking for again? Sun, right? Does that persona catch your eye? Thunderbird, Yadagarasu, Anubis. I gotta fuse a better Anubis. Like I did this one just for the stats or just to get the persona in, but my god, he's so bad. I gotta look up the I gotta look up um the fusion spells, cause like I don't I don't really have that many fusion spells. How do you feel about Akinari? I mean, I love Akinari just like everybody else. Okay, what rank are we with him? Okay, we're about to get him to rank three. This motherfucker just dying on the bench. <laughs> what up, Seabass? It's starting to settle down, I think. Thank you for coming. It's comforting to have someone with me. Aww. Why do I have to face this alone? Why am I the one? I can't run around like I did as a child anymore. Because my legs and heart won't even let me. All that's left is to draw my sheets around me and count the beats of my heart until they stop forever. Why is this only happening to me? I couldn't say. <laughs> of course not. No one could. I don't even know. I mean, I understand the reason I'm dying, but what even is the meaning of it? There isn't any meaning to life that I can find. So perhaps I'm not missing all that much. I wish I could run away, but if my body were capable of that, I wouldn't be here anyway. No matter what I do, my body is there to remind me I'm going to die. Why? Why me? <coughs> Please don't leave just yet. Aww. It's almost too much for me if I'm alone. Damn. Try not to talk too much. Yes, you're right. But... I'd still like to talk for just a little longer. I'm feeling... I love this song to have in the background, too. Thank you. My presence is comforting to Kamiki. I feel like our relationship is stronger. Dying young man. It's starting to get dark. Don't worry, I'll be fine now. I hope I can see you again soon. I parted ways with Kamiki and headed back to the dorm. Hey. Why would I cook with Amada? Let us instead see. Oh, it's Sunday, so no. It's just the persona stats. Uh, we have to get our uh, academics up. Mutatu is Sunday. I already got a max rank. They know me as a regular customer. I wonder if it's due to my charm. I'll try the seafood full course. Hooray! Come on, this has got to be a rank up on Adam's life. Um, right. I was asleep and missed everything. A lot of people missed a lot last stream. morning it doesn't seem like that chidori girl is gonna talk does it despite everything she did junpei is really worried about her just don't get why that's junpei for you yeah 
I guess, but I'm a little worried. Oh, I think they just said that the person that went missing died. <laughs> we can we can hang out with oh I could either hang out with Yukari or Fuka. Oh chat. Oh, this is so hard. I really don't know who I'm gonna choose. <laughs> Did you guys really think I would choose Fuka? Come on now. Great, why don't we head somewhere fun? Say that. That's right, there's this place I wanted to check out. Yo, what up, Sammy? Help me pick out something nice, would you? I'm doing well. Cute pink. You think so? I like pink too. I guess we have the same taste, huh? Then it's decided. I'll get these. Hmm. Come to think of it, Gerberas by themselves might be a little plain. What other flowers do you think would look nice? Oh, wait, you've never seen my room, have you? <laughs> well, then why am I even asking you? Uh, well, that's mean. I could have said invite me over then. That would have been crazy. To be honest, any flowers would be fine if they were from you. Oh, you meant that. Just kidding. We in. Never mind. <laughs> Man, Fuku wouldn't have said that shit to me. What a fly trap. Wow, look at the time. Gosh, what should I get? I'm actually a pretty indecisive person. I am also indecisive. Ranunculus wouldn't be bad either. Now she just making up words, bro. After hanging out with Yukari, I decided to uh, return to the dorm. Kirijo Senpai and the others are at the hospital and won't be back until later today. From what I hear, that girl Chidori won't say anything. Maybe we should hold off on going to Tartarus until things are under control. We get academics and the new Koromaru ability. Let's lock in, chat. I may not be done yet, but I'm 100% certain this is my goatee. I mean, this is probably gonna end up being just my favorite game of all time, to be honest. Koromaru seems to sympathize with the wolves leader protecting the pack. He gave me a look of fierce intimid or determination. Hmm. Keep up the great work. Koromaru is focused even harder on the wolf's pack leader now. Compared to before, the look in Koromaru's eyes seems to have changed. It's as if he gained a sense of pride from the wolf's leader. What else does he have here now? Auto Secunda lowers accuracy slash evasion of one random foe for three turns when a battle starts. Hey, chat, that's pretty fucking good, man. <laughs> that is pretty fucking good. You look determined. They actually made Koromaru good in this game. 
Let's fucking go! I don't want to alarm anybody, but we are one sub away from 10. Was Carl always this good? No, he was definitely not. Especially because uh, dark skills in the original Persona 3 were the insta-kill moves. So it was really bad. Looks like Chidori still ain't back yet. I get it's her own fault for running off on her own, but she's still one of us, you know? We gotta help her somehow. Don't be impatient, Jin. If she hasn't yet freed herself, that must mean her evoker was taken. Wait, where are they at? Like, the vibes here are kind of immaculate. Like, I want to visit this place. Our first objective must be to retrieve it. It would mean nothing to free Chidori without it. For us, our persona is as precious as our very lives. You meant that? wait for an opportunity. They found their own navigator, their own set of eyes. Without Chidori, we'd only be playing into their hands. Yeah, you're right, Takaya. Sorry I lost my cool there for a second. But what are we gonna do? They took down that shadow during the last full moon like it was nothing. If they got someone who can predict our moves, it'll be hard to catch them off guard. <sighs> yes, that's true. By the way, what is that thing? It looks like some kind of clunky evoker. This is one of the first evokers ever developed. Oh? I suppose you could call it a prototype. Oh, that's right. You've never seen this before, have you, Jin? <laughs> this was truly a terrible piece of work. In exchange for drawing out the full extent of a persona's latent power, the cost is that they become exceedingly difficult to control, especially for those who had their power forced upon them, like ourselves. To a persona that has lost control, the user is but a shackle. In those days, it was more commonplace to be killed by our own personas than by the shadows. Oh, wow. This was the result of one such killing. I am a shadow, the true self. <laughs> Regardless, I'm not one to dwell on the past. So, that's why you So, when that evoker. when that shadow drops the evoker, it was probably because that used to be a persona user who got like overcome by their persona or some shit or either that or that persona just killed that person and just like held on to the evoker or something. Hardly. The real reason is far more practical. I don't use one because I have no need. I don't require something as inelegant as a tool to prove my resolve. Damn, that's kind of a bar. You really are something special, Takaya. Yet, there is always someone out there who is even greater, such as one who can wield multiple. So Takaya is like their wild card. Am I feeling attachment for someone? <laughs> Impossible. <laughs> yeah, this scene is definitely new. You already at September. I thought I was ahead of you. Hey, you know me. I do crack. Not as much as him, though. <laughs> the guy? <sighs> Such a thought is beneath me. I can hear people talking. Hey there. Have you tried the famous beef bowl at Umuishi? Uh, umu, um, umi ushi, umi ushi. <laughs> it's only available for a limited time yep, yep. But only during fall Everyone who's anyone's been raving about it Lots of shops have been putting out new products lately Like at Manga Star Wait, you really haven't heard about any of this? You must have been out of the loop, huh? It's raining hard? Where are you, where are you located at? I don't think it's raining where I'm at what do you think, Yamagishi? Do you sense anything? No. <sighs> By refusing to speak, you're only hurting yourself. We aren't trying to keep you hostage. 
We just want to avoid unnecessary confrontation. How's Shidori? You're back again. Now you're spitting trespass. So hung up on her, Junpei. Did she say anything? Not a word. Let me talk to her. Yori, you're getting really emotionally invested in this. She said, look at you, emotional. <laughs> well, I know she attacked me. But I don't know. I, I just can't get her out of my head. Please, let me do this. Please never take the hat off again, man. Desperate times call for desperate measures, I suppose. All right, see if you can get through to her. Got it. You okay? <sighs> I'm glad they let you keep your sketchbook. Wow, you're still drawing pictures? Even in the hospital? You really do like to draw, huh? It doesn't matter. She spoke to him. Hooray! Only I can understand my drawings. Wait, Chidori, you're on. It's bleeding. Duh, not again. Yamagishi, get the doctor. All right. When is TSP coming Wait, back? I don't think I'm ever going to be able to commit she to a podcast like that again. I thought I took all the sharp objects <clears throat> in here. Oh, she cuts. She did this to herself? Apparently, we can't leave her unattended for even a moment. But at the very least, she seems to heal at an astonishing rate. Let, let go of me! And that cut on your hand back at the station, you did that to yourself? I never asked for you to worry about me. You are going to jump to conclusions. Well, I want you to stop. You can't be doing that. This is why June pays the goat. Because I'm worried about you. I don't want to see you hurting yourself. All right? The doctor will be here soon. You should head back. Right. So... You seem to have found your voice. <sighs> oh my God, you're too sexy to be depressed. Ah, type shit. No better than me. Uh, spend time with Shihiro. Wait, are we about to get her God rank 10? Oh my, this game always does this right before you get to 10, man. So fucking annoying. Oh my God. Wasting my days, bro. I just want to get this over with so I never have to talk to her again. Is that so wrong? It's about time to leave school. I decided to go back to the dorm. Yeah, chat, y'all ever risk somebody up in a library? Library risk is kind of fire. I have a favor to ask. It's about Amada. I have a hunch, but I think he's been feeling kind of down lately. Could you check on him when you have the time? Um, <laughs> not. <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh, fuck. Hey. And you getting a new ability? Do it. But Yukari could get a new ability. What's wrong, chat? You guys are going to make me cuck Yukari. Alright, man. You guys actually made me fucking curve you, Kari, for this. I'd like to talk. With me? Okay, but why 
why so suddenly? You aren't worried about me, are you? If so, thank you, but I'm totally fine. You can always talk to me. I'll do that. You're really caring, Senpai. Thanks for going out of your way to check on me. I'll do my best not to worry you. Well then, good night. Uh, I saw the N-I dash and I was like, what did he say? Come to think of it, I haven't had dinner yet. I should probably eat something. <sighs> um, Senpai, you wouldn't happen to be hungry, would you? <laughs> good what? <laughs> He's not here. Oh, uh, it's nothing. Sorry for asking you to go out all of a sudden. I just wanted someone to come with me. And it's a little intimidating going to get food by myself. People tend to stare when they see an elementary school kid like me out on his own. Your order? Two specials. Coming right up. Seems like that's the thing to get, huh? Thanks for ordering. So, I saw some people from our dorm stop by here a while back. Like Sonata san and that guy who recently joined. Aragaki san. Do you come here with them too? What kinds of things do you talk about? Is he investigating? Sorry for asking something so weird. I just thought I should know a bit more about everyone, since we'll be fighting together from now on. But it's good either way. Because I've always wanted to have a proper chat with you. Everyone in the dorm is amazing. But you're on a completely different level. Yeah, I'm kind of that guy. Yep. You're able to use. Here you are. That was fast as fuck. Ikutsuki-san and Mitsuru-san said that each person normally has only one persona. And that it doesn't change. That means what I saw back then was really... Uh, it's nothing. Sorry. Shall we eat? Did y'all hear about the rumor about Persona 1 remake? Hey, I hope it's true. Oh, I finished all this. But like the thing is, like, if if they do remake something like Persona 1 or 2, like, I feel like the game is not gonna be changed that much. Like, I feel like if they were to like remake those games and modernize them, I feel like so much of those games would have to change. It'd be like a pretty a, a brand new game. How far are you into the game? About like 36 hours or so. That sounds interesting. Yeah, it is. This is big news. Swallow doesn't usually make much of an impression, but there's a theory that he's actually stronger than Hawk. No way. Uh, I uh, heard that from a friend. TV shows like that seem to be popular in my class. I right. Them, so I have something to talk about. <laughs> anyway, it's been a while since I've enjoyed a meal like this. I guess it's because I'm eating with you. You're really okay, you okay. They're making Ken a lot better in this game already. Maybe next time we can I already like Ken a lot more in this game. Um, it's nothing. It's getting late. We should start heading back. It was delicious. No, this food was not delicious. Don't let yourself think like that. Yeah, he's a troubled little jit. You on your way home? Mm, us too. We just finished eating dinner. Oh, are you from the same class, Amadaku? Yes, it's nice to meet you. Oh yeah, Amada, you gotta join next month's soccer tournament. We've all been waiting for you, you know? We can even practice together after school. I'll have to pass. I'm not even sure if I could make it next month. Aw, oh, come on, we can't win without you. You're better than all of us. You can't pressure someone like that. Can't you see you're bothering him? I'm sure amata has a lot going on. Isn't that right? Oh, no, it's fine. I'm sorry. Please excuse us. You should hurry home too, amata What if I don't want to? Home. 
This episode's already been an hour and 40 minutes? Yo, what the fuck? Where's the time gone? Sorry about that. Do you not like playing soccer? No, it's not that. I just have enough to do. The second semester has already started and we have to go to Tartarus at night. I know we'll be going through a lot from now on. So I decided to not make any promises. Low-key responsible. More importantly, sorry for keeping you out so late. Let's make our way back to the door. Ooh, and I got academics for that. Okay, that, that worked out. That worked out. W's. It was worth it, chat. Hooray! Although, I could have got Yukari a new ability. But hopefully we can get that soon. Oh, he's also saying that he can't leave Chidori alone. Don't ask me why. You've got this. Yeah, thanks, man. Chat, you know what game I really want to try? I really want to try Hell Divers too. Should I should I order that game? Oh, Yukari. <gasps> Wait, but Yuko. Is Yuko about to become 10? Wait, where's Yuko at? Oh, she's only going to get to nine. I thought I got her to nine already. Um, I should probably just get Yuko out of the way, huh? All right, we got to get a strength persona. God damn it. Welcome to the velvet, Welcome room. To the velvet room. All right, so strength persona. Mm, whatever. They giving Kobe three statues? Wait, really? Hey, man, if there's a player that deserves them, I feel like he's one of them. Okay, Gecko Khan High. Oh, Yuko! Daddy's home! It seems like Yuko wants to walk home together. Let's do it. <laughs> so then I went to ask about it after class, and you know what happened? Miss Miyahara just wouldn't stop talking. She wrote out some weird math formula and said, it's beautiful, isn't it? All it did was make me more confused than I originally was. <laughs> Guess we'll have to go ask again tomorrow. Um, sh you're so hardworking. Me when I fucking lie. What up, Veggie? You think so? I guess it just feels wrong to not try and understand something. Anyways, I decided to start being serious about my future. Chat, she's future. confronting her future. Let's go. It was when I handed in a blank answer sheet for that pop quiz and I got yelled at by Akoda. Back then, I just wanted to graduate and go to a community college or something. But after coaching those kids, I started to realize something. I enjoy helping people who are willing to give it their all. So I finally figured out what I want to do with my life. Can you guess what it is? An instructor? Hmm, close. You almost got it, Mr. X assistant coach. Hooray! I'm thinking of becoming an athletic trainer. It's their job to monitor each athlete's diet and help them plan their training routine. So I'll go to She's the reason why LeBron got the body he got. And then work towards earning my certification when I turn 20. Between the general education requirements and the classes for my major, it's going to be over 350 hours. Bam! 
That's why I'm gonna start studying right now. Improving my writing is my first 350 hours or two persona games. Had a huge influence on me. I know I only agreed to coach them on a whim, but teaching them really made me think. I started wondering what I could teach my own kids one day, and I realized I didn't have the slightest clue. You hadn't been there with me. I don't think I could have stuck it out until the end. And I Aww. definitely never would have thought about my future either. So, thanks. Aw, baby cakes, you're welcome. Yuko seems appreciative. I feel like our relationship has grown. Rank up! Rank nine. Uh, also, I know I'm always asking you to stick around and help me with stuff. I just, I kind of feel bad about it. I'm sorry. I realize now that I might have been relying too much on you. Mm. <clears throat> you can rely on me even more. Oh. Why, why are you so nice to me? Yuko seems restless. I better choose my words carefully here. Come to think of it, I have another special relationship with another person already. Um. Are you like this just with me? No, no, that, that can't be it. Uh, what? Girl, there's no one else in my life. Like, what? Come on, like, quit playing. You know about me, like... You know my body, like, you know what I'm about, like, come on, you know me. You go look at me, you know me, bruh. It's because I love you. Huh? huh? What? <laughs> you mean me? Uh, uh, are, are you sure? I'm not girly or anything like that. Aww. What's happening? <laughs> Is this a dream? Please, that triggered me. Uh oh. Baby, I said I love you. Uh, um, me. Tell you shit. It's that every shit I'm on, chat. Yuko's face is bright red. I feel the same way as you do. That's why I'm so happy. <laughs> ah, W manipulation. I've entered a special relationship with Yuko. There's no going back now. Uh, go. <laughs> I'm a little bit of a whore. Um, I'm looking forward to us. Yeah, me too, baby. Me too, baby. Anyways, yo, Yukari, what you up to tonight? <laughs> Chihiro, you trying to get you trying to get social link 10? <laughs> yo, me too. You trying to stomp on my neck? <laughs> Take shit. By the way. How long have you been holding that Chidori girl? Uh, about four days. I see. Take me dick, I'm on chat. Take me dick, I'm on chat. You feel what I'm saying? Take shit, take shit. <laughs> Yo, Arklet, thank you for the prime for 34 months. That's 10 subs for the day so far. I appreciate y'all. W y'all, W y'all. I'm gonna tell you shit. This is the type of dick. Yo, chat, once if you're here. Uh, cultivating power, sweet talking. Courage. Cultivating your thinking power. This sounds like it gives you academics. No? That sounds like academics to me, boys. Hey! I played the quiz game. You're the answer. This has got to be a rank up. On my life, this is a rank up. On my life. Mm. 
Um, right! Right! <laughs> it's coming soon though, chat. Do you know what it means to spill the beans? I knew the answer, but I just had to make sure. Also, who is she? Mmm. Delicious. Yo, Cheetorita. Cheetorita? Hold on now. Don't call me that. <laughs> Come on, lighten up. Here, I brought you a new sketchbook. I thought your old one might be getting full. I don't remember asking you to do that, Junpei. <laughs> Finally called me by my name. I wasn't sure if you'd ever say it again. Hmm. Hmm. Any luck? She finally started talking, but she hasn't said anything useful so far. Well, it's a start. More of a response than we got from her. So, why are you here? Shidori, what's wrong? Oh, shit. What is that? There's something right there. An enemy? Wrong. Move. <sighs> Shidori! Relax. Her persona just went berserk. It happens. Happens. Weren't you guys watching? You could see her persona strangling her for a second. They're not like us. Holy they shit! Fully control their personas. That's why they need to take suppressants to keep their personas from killing them. That's why should you want to know how long, how many days she's been in? Oh shit! Some things you only pick up stepping off the straight and narrow. I'll give the duck the meds I have. The rest is up to you. Shinji, wait! Hey! Uh, I... Junpei? <sighs> Thank God. I thought you were gonna die. What do you mean? Why do you look so scared? Oh. to be afraid of. Junpei X Chidori, the goats. What are you talking about? Dying just means you won't wake up tomorrow. That's all. What the hell are you saying? You don't really mean that, do you? Junpei? I don't want that. You hear me, Chidori? I don't want you to die. Junpei. It doesn't matter if you're not afraid. That's not the point. I don't want to have to live in a world without you. <laughs> you're so weird, Junpei. Look who's talking. How are you confused about that, Ooh? What the hell's going on? Why did you have those suppressants? I've heard about what they do. They're taken to rein in a persona when the user can't control it. But the side effects... You're not taking them, are you? Answer me! We don't have to tell you shit. Oh, shit. Why are you always like this? Save it. I've heard it all before. You think I'm wasting my power. You can't stand the sight of someone so half-assed, right? I'm sick of your damn preaching. Oh, fuck! Shit. You don't understand at all. You should already know. Ten years ago. Oh, my God. When the orphanage burned down, I couldn't save my sister. Back then, I wasn't strong enough to get past the adults holding me back to even try. His voice is so good. That's 
That's why I try so hard. I thought you felt the same way. We promised each other to become strong enough to do what we think is right. Yo, this performance is fire. Why? Why'd you start taking those drugs without telling me? I'm back in the fight now. I have no reason to suppress my persona anymore. So just let it go. Damn it. And the side effects. Hmm. There's something I need to take care of. It's something only I can do. I gotta take responsibility. What do you mean? Listen. Quit worrying about me. Just do what you think is right. Got that? Shinji. That was a good scene. That was a great scene. I want to hang out with you, Kari, but we're about to social link 10 Chihiro. Let's just get Chihiro out of the way, chat, and then we can never talk to her again. Oh, happy to hear it. Um, in that case, would you like to come over to my house? It's a little far, but... Wait a minute. This is the illustration collection I wanted, remember? I bought all three. I blew my whole allowance, but it was definitely worth it. This book is by the same artist. If you're interested, you can borrow it. Why the fuck would I want to do that? Promise to think of me when you read it. Oh, wow, she a freak bull. Thank you. Oh, no, no problem. I've read it so many times that I've practically got it memorized. Oh? She has to stay late at work. And I, I've heard that there have been assaults on women in this area recently. Uh, I really don't want to be alone. Please stay. Just one more hour. I, I don't have to spell it out, do I? It's getting late. Specific, I don't want you to go back to your dorm. There's so many attractive girls there. Oh, she's just it's jealous. Evident. Oh, have to go back eventually. But could we be here together for just a little longer? I want you to stay. I just need to know that you only have eyes for me. Oh my gosh, you want me so bad. Chihiro has expressed her love for me. <laughs> Not her begging. <laughs> beep, beep, beep. Yeah, well. Rank up. Hooray. We can now fuse Melchizedek. Melchizedek. Hey! Type of shit I'm on! Type of shit I'm on! I spent a long time with your hero. W Huggers. Who banging my line? Hello. Somebody wandered into Tartarus? Oh. That a path that had been blocked off is now open. I thought it proved well then. Thank you, Elizabeth. Don't ever call me again. Oh, it's you. Iori may be permitted to look over that girl for the time being. Now's not the time to bombard her with questions. Besides, we still have three shadows to contend with. We should be able to accomplish that within the next few months. Unless the situation changes. Don't let your guard down until the very end. I can read with Fuka, and that should get me uh, some knowledge. All right. All right. Glad to hear it. Okay, I'll go check in my room or whatever. So the other day, I recommended the novel I'm reading to a classmate. I don't talk to her much, but at the time we were discussing a movie we'd both seen. 
She wasn't too keen on the recommendation and turned me down, though. It was because the series looked hard to get into. There are so many volumes. She's missing out. If she just gave it a chance, I know she would see how interesting it is. One Piece fan, oh my god. No wonder y'all like her so much. And even that by itself already sounds intriguing. And the writing is so unique and poetic. I can't help but get sucked in. Recommending something to someone is a really tricky thing, huh? Well, thank you anyways. I appreciate you showing interest in that book. Okay, I think I'll read a little further myself. <sighs> I finished the whole thing. Surely my academics levels up now. Right. Time flies by so quickly. Let me know your thoughts on it next time. Well then, good night. I'm gonna stay stupid forever, man. God damn it. Morning. So, there's something bothering me lately. Why did Aragaki Senpai suddenly decide to come back? I'm not sure. Yeah. Well, he looks scary, but he doesn't look like the type who'd rejoin just because he likes to fight. Maybe there's a reason. Well, then. <laughs> oh, chat, check the date. Uh, oh, I know this one. It's definitely 100% the Hermetica. Like, we all know that. Like, that one was so easy. Like, I'm such a genius, bro. Oh, we can spend time with Aragaki. Oh, I forgot about Hayase as well. Wait, what is the... Is Shinji here? Oh, wait, Mitsuru. Sorry for the sudden call. I'll keep it brief. I wanted to hand this to you. I'd appreciate it if you could deliver that to Aragaki. Tell him it's from me. He'll know what's inside. A school reinstatement form. Oh, he's coming back to school? I'm sure you're already aware, but Aragaki is a student at our school, but currently on a leave in ab uh, of absence. If he's in good health, I believe it's in his best interest to start attending classes again. But no matter what I or even Akihiko say to him, he won't have any of it. So, I'm changing my approach. Perhaps you may be able to get through to him. Can I count on you? All right. Thank you. I really like these little, uh, I don't know what you call them, side quests or what. It would only become more difficult to persuade him if this became public. Aragaki is usually at that gathering spot near the station during the day. When you get the, uh, when you get the chance, could you head over there and look for him? I'm counting on you. You again. What do you want? I found Aragaki. Should I give Aragaki the re-enrollment form Mitsuru entrusted me with? What? You got a bone to pick or something? So, what do you want? Type shit. What's this supposed to be? Why do you have this? Oh, now I get it. Kirijo put you up to this. She asked me to. Typical. She always goes out of her way for the dumbest shit. But that's why she's the goal, right? Think for yourself for once. Don't just go along with what everyone asks. I'm worried about you too, bro. Mind your own damn business. Why are you all like this? But I guess you can't. Explains why you've accepted being leader. <laughs> we done? Get out of here. 
Hey. My fault, OG. Fuck. Thanks for going through all that trouble. Maybe I'll treat you to a meal sometime. Wait, Shinji! He likes us, chat! You got a problem with that? How about right now? I told you to get going. I already got plans. It doesn't matter. I'll be back by tonight. That's why I rejoined in the first place. We rock with Shinji. We rock with Shinji. Hooray! Hit him with the ch. I decided to go back to the dorm without Aragaki. What? I got courage? I need academics. God fucking damn Okay. It is now evening time. Welcome back. Chad, I'm not gonna lie, I'm fully torqued. Uh, is this an Elizabeth request? Yep. Marvelous. Thank you for the Twilight Fragments. Here are my requests. Where I can take her out? A shame. No. Oh. Well, fuck you then. Very well. All right, she's gonna gain a new ability, chat. Pop it, let it bang! What's it gonna be? Awesome, let's go make something tasty. I'm thinking of using the cabbage in the fridge to make a cream stew. Oh, I could show you a cream stew. Core, so I'll go ahead and use the entire thing. As you can see, I've done my homework. <laughs> Did you come prepared? Looking forward to it. I'm back on my game after making that perfect chicken saute. This will be no problem at all. Okay, less talking, more cooking. I'll handle the main dish with the cabbage. So how about you start on the rice and stuff? We're playing fucking overcooked. I cooked together with Yukari. <clears throat> the cream stew is mild and delicious. <sighs> I'm stuffed. We made short work of that, huh? So, how would you like today's meal? Yum! Oh, you said it! You actually said yum! Finally! I just had to get you to say it today. Okay. Hey, remember when I said the very first time we cooked together? That I'd make it so delicious you couldn't help saying yum. I honestly do not remember that, but sure. But I gotta say, it's nice seeing the look on someone's face when they're eating something they really like. It's not just about proving myself. It's that I really wanted to see that smile again. Yo, she might be in love with me. Did that make me sound selfless? Sorry, but this is still a two-way street. Next time, it's your turn to do something for me. Let's make some yummy memories together. Reduces SP cost of recovery skills to 50%. Hello! That's really good, chat. Thanks for today. Let's do this again when you have some time. Okay. Her healing spells got reduced by 50%. We'll take that. Good morning. Somebody wandered into Tartarus. Wait. I think she just said that was a soul. Oh. Someone I know is lost in Tartarus. Oh. Right. Our next topic. Leave him? We don't know who it is, though. Chidori! Oh, is gonna be here today. But they said we still can't give you back your evoker. I wasn't expecting them to. That's why I'm in here in the first place. Oh yeah, uh, how's that cut doing? 
Ah, right. Probably healed already, huh? So, you're not drawing today? Does it matter? Well, uh, not really. Huh. Your flowers wilted. Uh, the heat must have got to them. Oh, I know. Why don't I go buy you some fresh ones? What's your favorite kind of... Hey, what's wrong? <sighs> oh, shit! Huh? Flowers? Yeah, those are cut flowers, right? Oh, how'd you do that? I gave them a little bit of my energy. I didn't know your healing powers could do stuff like that. It's like a miracle or something. It's nothing special. You have powers too, don't you? This is just another form they can take. Well, yeah, I guess. But that's about all I've got going for me. Without this power, I'd be a nobody. I just talk a big game, pretending like I'm some kind of hero. But in reality, I don't know what the hell I'm fighting for. In fact, I don't even really have a good reason to live. Holy shit, Junpei. Good reason to live? Dude. Good reason. When I was a kid, I had this silly dream. A dream? I used to want to grow up to be a pro baseball player. Pretty stupid, huh? But I guess that's part of being a kid. I wouldn't really know. I don't remember much from my childhood. I only remember one thing. Being surrounded by white. Everything was white. Hmm. I hate hospitals. Oh, you do. Um, sorry. But you've been coming to see me here, so I don't mind as much. Oh, chat. Chidori. Did you mean it? Then I'll come to see you every day. Yucatan. Fuck. Okay, let me finish Yuko and I will give you my undivided attention, okay, Yukari? Oh. All right, chat. Let's get our second wife. Do you want to come over again? I wanted to give you something. You meant that shit? That's all, really. I just wanted to give you a little something. No big deal, right? Type of shit I'm on. Oh, I forgot to mention. During lunch break today, that girl was trying to bother me again. You remember, right? She's the one who put gum on my shoe locker. Well, this time, I told her what I thought right to her face. That she should find what she really wants to do in life. Damn, cooked. She probably didn't get what I was saying, but ever since I figured it out for myself, I feel like I've been able to see the bigger picture. I mean, I kind of used to be the same as her, you know? I guess I've learned how to empathize better now. Not to mention, you did end up becoming my boyfriend, so... Um... But yeah, sure. Never mind. I'm not going to correct you. you here. I guess I could have told you this next part at school, but I wanted to talk some more quiet. Mm. What is it? D don't be so impatient. I'm getting to that. Oh, why am I the one panicking now? <laughs> so, you know the kids we coached? Yeah. They each left a message for us. Oh, They were kind of a handful. But they also have an endearing side to them, don't you think? Yeah. Oh, you're so sweet. Sometimes I can't believe how open-minded you are. I think I need to learn from you. Here, this one's for you. The kids told me to give it to my boyfriend. <laughs> Aren't they cute? That's what I invited you here for. Well, actually, that was just an excuse. Because today, well, my parents aren't home. Oh. So. <laughs> I see. Yeah. So, um, I, I just mean you can stretch out and relax. <laughs> we won't get yelled at for being too noisy. <laughs> oh, you a freak bull. It's just. 
I was able to find my true calling thanks to you. I'm so glad I met you. Those are my true feelings, and I hope you feel the same. So, will you stay with me a while longer? Yuko has expressed her love for me. Type of shit I'm on. Another social link 10. That's the type of dick I'm on, chat. That's the type of dick I'm on, chat. Rank up. Rank max. We can now fuse a Tavika. I love you. Oh, wow. That's amazing. Anyways, I will never speak to you again, but thank you for allowing me to summon a very strong persona. <laughs> One more added to the hair. Um, I believe I don't get nothing if I hang out with you, Unforge. What do you want? What? Ah, uh, why should I? <sighs> don't think I'll go easy on you. Are you romancing Fuka too? If I get to it. Whoops. Men only want one thing from women, and it's their ultimate Arcana personas. <laughs> True. You know that? Asking me to teach you how to cook. What do you want to learn so much? I don't think I want to be popular. Well, we all got our own reasons. Can't hurt to know this stuff. But you better put in the work if you want to be popular. I was taught how to cook by someone else too. So when I see someone who wants to learn, I can kind of relate. Okay. That's enough rambling. Let's get started. You're going to do it this time. So first, get the meat ready. I'm sorry, get the what ready? When you're frying something, stick a chopstick in the oil and check for little bubbles. Wait, you're putting on too much heat. The meat ain't gonna taste good if it's too tough. Pretty good job, considering it was your first try. I need a man like Shinji, low-key, and likes to cook for people. Love me a man who can feed me. That's W's. Shinji is a W man. serious about it, then just practice. All right, let's clean up. You Oops, I didn't mean to skip that, sorry. Hi, it's been a while. Three seasons have passed since we met. Time goes by so quickly. And in that time, many things change. But at the same time, some things in this world will always remain the same. Don't you agree? Uh, yeah, sure, man. I see. If that's what you say, then it must be true. Talking with you has stirred up certain memories. Like that tower, for one. It's been on my mind a lot lately. I wonder, will our relationship stay the same? Or... Will it evolve? <laughs> no matter what the future holds, you and I will always be friends. Little kid, I don't even like you. Rank six. Hooray. I'll see you again. But until then, good night. All right, it's Sunday chat. You know what that means. Who's banging my line? Please don't let it be a bad bitch. Please don't let it be a bad bitch. Please don't let it be a bad. Akinari. Akinari, look, man. Akinari, look. I know you only have a couple days left on this planet, but you Kari want to chill with me. So like, so like, I just feel like, 
Uh, okay, buy that. Shinji is today. Lock in. Bro, I'll probably have other chances to do the Shinji thing. I should probably just do Akinari while I can. Thing with your upper head, not the lower. I fear I can't do that. I might be tripping, but they're on pretty tight schedules. Bro, every time I hang out with somebody during one of these, like the next few days, I always see people doing it. Like, I can only do this one once a week. Like, there's no way it's so tight that you have to do them that specific day. I'm doing better today. Mm -mm -mm. I know it probably looked dire last time, right? Sorry if I scared you. I'd been reading a book before we met that day. I guess I got so absorbed in it that I didn't realize how cold the wind was. Do you enjoy reading books? I'd say so. I see. That's something we have in common then. Whose grandma is this? Nowadays, this is a sickly boy. This is all I do. I find that they give me a way to escape everything else. I can just get lost in the book's private world. Do you read books all the way through? Oh, do you? I don't usually reach the end either. Although I think our reasoning differs. <clears throat> the more engaging a story is... Can't believe all these spoilers. Hey, bruh. I'm always afraid to finish it because once I finish the story, I'll have to come back to reality. Damn. This inescapable body of mine. Heartwarming stories filled with hope. Those are the kinds of books I like to read. They give me a little solace when I have to come back to the real world. Looks like the sun is already setting. Time is so ruthless. I hope we have another chance to talk. I am not built to be a streamer. Nobody is built to be a streamer, bro. You just gotta hate yourself uh, enough to actually do this shit. I can read with Mitsuru. Would that get me academics? I did hate myself, then I got money, then I hated myself with money. Damn, I just hate myself. Alright, let's read with Mitsuru, get our knowledge up. I put a lot of thought into what books I brought. I just took whatever caught my attention. I apologize. I should have asked what your preferences were beforehand. If you don't mind my asking now, what kinds of books do you usually read? Uh, novels. Oh, do you now? I'm partial to historical fiction myself. I actually read a lot of it. I'm yeah, Mitsuru is... Mitsuru is definitely, uh, very pretty. ...to experience another person's life. That reminds me, Yamagishi mentioned liking novels as well. I never inquired further, but maybe she'd make some No, I'd rather have you be my reading partner, actually. Incidentally, the books I brought today are things like biographies and history books. I can attest that they're all worthwhile reads. Rather accessible ones, too. I hope you find them to your liking. Oh my, you're really tearing through the pages. I'm impressed by your- It's not all I can tear through, baby. My bad. This is a rank up or may God murder me right now? Thank you, God. <clears throat> One more level. It's nice to spend some time reading quietly together like this. Thank you. That made for a relaxing evening. I love me a good murder mystery. You're such a woman. Good night.
you know what? A haunted house. I bet I'll be stuck playing the ghost. Hooray. Yeah. That doesn't sound too bad. You can just show up and put on the costume. I actually need to practice for a magic show. But I also heard a typhoon is on its way. And that it's a big one. Are people really going to uh, turn up? Don't y'all like murder mystery books too? That's your first problem, thinking that I know how to read. Attention. Yes. <clears throat> okay, who can we hang out with today? Yukatan! Hooray! Wait, never mind, we got Shinji to do. Sorry, Yukari. Hey. Let's go out if you've got the time. Let's do it. I see. I really got all this fucking charm for no reason, by the way. Two specials. Two specials coming right up. What up, Black Corvus? Why'd you bring me here? Because I said I treat you. I can't go back on my word. It's bad for my conscience. Huh. That makes sense. I'm just keeping the promises I made. That's all. Here you go. Two specials. Point is. You don't go back on your word, especially when it comes to something you promised. Hmm. Let's eat. Right. Don't want the noodles to get soggy. I was thinking earlier, you really don't take any shit, even from your elders. No, I'm pretty badass, right? Let's trouble that way. Let's finish up and get the hell out of here. Welcome back. Were you together? Hmm? Jealous? Wait, Aragaki. Have you considered returning to school at all? It's been some time since second semester started. Regarding your attendance, it'd be best if you went back as soon as possible. <laughs> Having some second thoughts, that shit? I got the paperwork, but I don't remember saying anything about turning it in. What's the point anyhow? I got no business there. Then why... why did you come back here? I apologize. It isn't my place to ask that. Everything is my fault. I shouldn't have gotten you or Akihiko involved. Mitsuru? Cut that out. I'm the one who chose to join you back then. However things turned out after that has nothing to do with you. I didn't know what I was capable of. That's all there is to it. Then why are you so determined not to return to school? You'll be throwing your future away if you don't go back. You can't force him. Right. I apologize. Polka, did you ever think that maybe you're the red flag? I don't plan on forcing you into anything did in the past. What's important is it's your own decision, Aragaki. <laughs> Looks like you have changed. Just a little bit. You always used to avoid relying on people. <clears throat> Not so much of a lone wolf anymore, huh? Nah, it's because she needs me. The only choice we have is to keep moving forward. That goes for myself, Akihiko, and you. Oh. Please, Aragaki, just give it another chance. What up, Strap? What are you guys up to? Akihiko? Looks like a pretty serious discussion. Let me guess. This president is lecturing the delinquent on the importance of his education? Yeah, pretty much. Well, I'll be damned. For a protein-fueled, muscle-bound moron, you're pretty smart. What was that? CMS president. This delinquent's gonna go to his room and think about his bad choices. 
Wait, we're not finished yet. Akihiko, why are you like this? Huh? Uh, what just happened? Was it something I said? Uh, bad timing. <laughs> well, that's not my fault. It's nothing new. I'll just apologize later. What up, Scoobert? Type of dick I'm on. Let's talk about it. Showers are incredibly overrated. To who? Ah, gotcha. I was just joking. You guys are so gullible. Like, I was obviously joking. Like, come on, chat. You guys know about me. Right? What the dog doing? Officially being trapped here for a year. Jace, thank you for the year. You're not trapped. You just can't go anywhere without dying. That's all. But I appreciate the year. February 14th is a Uber Lyft slash DoorDash strike. Uh, damn, I got to go fend for myself. Yo. Just three shadows left, huh? And only three more weeks until the next one appears. Personally, I'd rather take on all three at once to save us the trouble. Don't underestimate them. <laughs> You're right. Every enemy we face has been stronger than the last. But since we've got more manpower, it should be easier to defeat them. I can't wait for the next full moon. You plan on doing the next full moon in this stream? Yeah, this part of the of the video will probably be the three weeks and a big Tartarus section. And then I'll probably end off there and then start the next full moon uh, in the beginning of the next episode. Wait, Yukari? Okay. You can spend time with Koromaru. The P3 soundtrack ain't soundtracking. I think you smoke cock. I'm not gonna lie. I wanna know what type, what, what branded dick you smoking. Y'all saw the G Fuel collab? I might have to cop. Wait, they made a Persona 3 cup? I actually have to buy that. What happened? What happened? Don't worry, I got Koromaru. We better hurry. I'm sorry. There's a boy on the top of the jungle gym. Get him, Koro. Karamaru is trying to reason with the stray dog. Grown ass man in the booth barking into a U87. Let's chase it away. Persona! Get him. 
Dang, Carl Maru with the W press. I helped the boy get down. The dog in the jungle gym was so scary. I thought I was gonna die. Thanks for helping me, mister. It's all thanks to Koromaru. Yeah, thanks, Koromaru. And I brought them here. I knew where to find Koromaru all along. Alright, girl. You say so. Sounds right to me. I knew it. Karamaru is this town's watchdog. Oh, by the way, are you Koromaru's new owner? <laughs> We're friends. W. Is there really a difference? Did this little jit ask if there's a difference between friends and an owner? Hey man, maybe we should have let that dog eat you. I don't know. As long as he's happy. Uh oh, you better get home soon. Hey Chad, are we friends? Okay, see you guys later. We're trapped here? Like I said, what's the difference? Some beautiful flowers are laid there. They look new. Are these here to memor uh, to honor the memory of the priest? Naisu, Naisu. Welcome back. I heard that Chidori-san is starting to open up a little. But it seems that she's still uncomfortable talking about personas. It might take some time before she's ready. That's fine. We still have three shadows to worry about, so let's focus on that. They'll be sorry they ever set foot into this world. Chilling in my bed. Hey. All right, and now we're gonna get Yukari another brand new ability. Let's see what it is. I love you. My bad. How mm -hmm. my attention, but I was afraid it might be too scary for me. But I'm glad I watched it. I guess it's important to break out of your comfort zone. Very true. Do you ever try watching things from genres you don't normally get into? I'm a canine at heart. I'm a dog. Hell divers dropped today and apparently it's mid. Oh wait, what? I actually wanted to try it out. If I'm with someone. I'm the same way. Isn't yeah. it easier to try something new when you have someone with you for the ride? Yeah. It's also nice to be able What's to the fastest you guys say I love you to someone? Uh, I used to say I love you to the person that uh rung me out for my Snickers bar at the gas station. We she accidentally touched my hand when she grabbed the Snickers and said and I was like, I love you. We've literally all been there. Like how she can't turn a blind eye to people in need and extends her hand to almost anyone. And of course, two days, not even joking. Okay, that's kind of pathetic. Did she say it back? Uh, no. She told me to get the fuck out of her soul before she shot me. Remember how I told you about that girl I was close to who started ignoring me one day? I do remember this. It's not like I did anything to make her hate me. We've been friends for a long time, but one day out of the blue, she just said, my mother told me I can't play with you anymore. Girl, you holding on to a girl that didn't want to hang out with you no more when you was like five? It's 
because there were rumors oh. going around about my parents. I kind of get it now, looking back, but at the time, I was just sad. <sighs> what I'm trying to say is, this show made me realize I'd like to be a little more like the main character. I want to be the kind of person who'd help anyone at any time. Someone who's kind and strong. It might be silly to say I look up to a fictional character, but there's no harm in following her example. At least that's what I think. Right. Reduces SP cost of recovery skills to 25%. Holy shit. Dude, her her recovery spells are like free. That ending was so good. I hope they'll make a sequel. I got something we could film. I got something we could film. I'll bring more DVDs I'm curious about next time. Oh, it's about time we head back to our rooms. Have a good night, okay? Okay. I can hear people talking. Hey, Did you hear? Yukari Takaba is going to wear a maid dress for the culture festival. Seriously? Is this a blessing from heaven? Stop talking about my girl like that, bro. The archery team is doing a maid cafe and she drew the short straw. I heard she's not stoked about it, so we got to go support her, right? Uh oh. First time I tuned into this channel was Persona 5. Omega literally got me to buy a PS4. Hope he got royalties off of that. I definitely didn't, but I'm glad you uh, you played the game. Oh my God, I got to hang out with Aragaki again, but I want to do Yukari social link, man. Oh my God. Uh, wait, there's two? There's Loki too much to do. Oh, it's Koromaru. Loki, who gives a fuck about Koromaru's? What is he gonna do? Help another dumbass kid off a jungle gym? <laughs> Dog got anxiety, bitch, me too. <laughs> while you're at school i haven't suddenly decided to go back to school or anything that's a form to extend my leave of absence oh don't make much sense to beat an extracurricular squad if i get expelled but i'll drop it if i can stay absent from school why are you giving this to me going myself would be more of a pain than it's worth plus it seems like kirijo depends on you it should be pretty easy to hand it off if you do it at school. I'll pay you back for this. So help me out, all right? Have you talked to Sonata? This has nothing to do with him. Oh, fuck. Wait, what did he say? I already know what Aki would say. Huh. I don't see you two together oh, very often. Oh, Akihiko! What are you guys doing back here in the middle of the day? Thank you for not skipping dialogue. I've seen some people do it and not care about this story. Why would anybody do it that way? Also, it's funny you said that when I literally did accidentally skip a text box just now. But yeah, uh, the story is the best part. What the fuck? Especially in this game, it's so good. Envelope. I'm guessing that's not the form <laughs> for returning to school. Hey, if Shinji keeps this up, You'll be his classmates next year. You and Junpei should practice addressing him casually. In fact, go ahead and boss him around a bit. I'd rather get expelled. <laughs> I'm going to finish the battle this year. I've got no reason to stay enrolled after that. <sighs> Shinji! You know exactly how concerned Mitsuru is about you. You know what this form means to her, don't you? Don't tell me you forgot her promise. I did I seen a streamer skip over Ken's lore because they hate the child. 
Ken is, first of all, Ken's uh, backstory is actually really interesting and it makes a lot of sense as to why he behaves the way he does. And also this game, I feel like adds quite a bit to him. I've never seen Shinji ask someone else for help with his own problems before. He'd never say it out loud. But I think he really trusts you. Huh. Maybe. <laughs> Even just being able to stand a guy that antisocial is an accomplishment. I think he actually likes the fact that you don't back down from anyone. I'm not gonna nag Shinji about going back to school anymore. Just do what you think is best. I'll leave it to you. Okay, we got academics up. I need another midterm thing, man. Oh, welcome back. Is it just my imagination or have the loss been proliferating more quickly than usual lately? There are over two weeks until the next full moon, so why? I suppose we should just focus on what we can accomplish right now. We'll deal with this next shadow swiftly and effectively. So dance, if you wanna go ahead, Chilling in my bed. Uh, I can read with Igis. That should get me some knowledge. Let's see what reading with Igis is like. Are you available tonight? I have borrowed a book about Yakuza from the library. I was searching for combat-related material and the librarian suggested this. It seems to provide information on combat tactics, as well as the proper mindset for battle. Uh, damn, this is not gonna give me knowledge. Ah, uh, whatever. You have my thanks. We only have one book, so please open it wide so that we may both view its contents. <laughs> what the? Usually, people's asses are already cracked. Yours is as well, right? What the fuck, I guess? Yo, what the? <laughs> um, I mean, girl, are like, you trying to take a look or what? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Yo, this shit came out of nowhere. What the hell? I was not expecting this. Uh, that's a secret. Yeah, she wanted to know what my ass crack looked like. What, what the fuck? Currently, this is the only section that I am unclear on. <laughs> Freaky out <laughs> robot. <laughs> Yo, I guess. What? If you don't mind, could I ask you to read with me until the end? <laughs> Thank you very much. With your help. I've been able to update my records with new information. Apparently, this book has a sequel. If it is possible, I would like to read with you again sometime. All right. It's gotten rather late. Did you literally get charm for existing in this game, man? I heard there's a nasty typhoon on the way. You think we'll still have the culture festival Saturday? Nah. nah, I don't think so. The way they're talking, the typhoon's gonna be way too destructive. You seriously think it's gonna be canceled? Man, after all that work we put into preparing for it. What up, Squire? Apparently big typhoon coming. Okay, surely there's nothing stopping me from hanging out with Yukari. Right? Mitsuru. Uh, 
Oh my god. When I play this game again, I'm gonna focus on charm way less. Yeah, literally. Do Mitsuru doesn't take time. Oh, thank God. Hello. Right, I thought as much. He's certainly stubborn, I'll give him that. But that is his decision, so there's nothing more we can do. I apologize for making you run back and forth so much. But thanks to you, I think I can finally lay this matter to rest. I appreciate your help. Tell me what's going on. After everything you've done, I suppose I do owe you an explanation, but not here. Let's relocate to the student council room. I assure you it won't take long. I don't think I ever told you about how things were before you joined. Seas originally started off with only three members. Back in middle school, I invited Akihiko to join. They were in middle school? I followed him soon after. Hold on! No idea what we were doing back then. Wait, this is so cool! We were young, inexperienced, and we had almost no intel to work off of. We could barely even make it past the entrance to Tartarus back then. Actually exploring the tower like we're doing now was nothing more than a pipe dream. Even with all our shortcomings, we worked decently as a team. As peers, it was easy for us to connect. And the work was hard, but fulfilling. I wish I could have seen it. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm not complaining about our current circumstances. We've discovered how to eliminate the dark hour, and we've since grown much stronger. However, after what happened in Yakushima, and with Aragaki rejoining, it's hard not to remember the old days. I'm so concerned about re-enrolling him in school because I'm still living in the past. Living in the past? Yes. So <gasps> after we started school, Look at Shinji! Came to an agreement. Oh my god, they look Oh my they look so different. Holy shit. We promised we'd all graduate together. No one left behind. Akihiko was just as reckless back then, too. Our Gaki was always the one reminding him that our lives were at stake. Although his wording certainly wasn't quite so thoughtful. Hmm. I can imagine. <laughs> It suits him, doesn't it? I guess you've gotten to know him well. Ever since he left the team, he's acted like he's wanted to punish himself. It's almost like he just wants to waste away. I'm hoping he'll remember his promise and take a step back and look at himself. That's why I gave you the paperwork to get him back in school. That was my last hope, but I suppose it didn't work out. I'll tell Akihiko myself. All right, I'll take this. I'll start on the process for extending his leave of absence. It seems Mitsuru and Sonata were really hoping Aragaki would return to school. It's Loki giving. It's Loki giving legendary Sanin, fucking Jiraiya Orochimaru and uh, Tsunade type shit. I think I should think carefully about whether to hand this over or not. Oh. What's the matter? Chat, do I hand it over to her? Like Shinji wanted me to. But do we think it's the right thing to do? I feel like I got to give it to her. Like this is what literally what Shinji wanted. You feel me? Like who am I to, who am I to like impede on that? You feel me? Like Sure. What's wrong, though? Is it missing a page? I'll let you handle it then. Make sure to let Aragaki know as well. Wait. 
She gave me, wait, what? Oh, they want me to get him to reconsider. Holy shit, chat. And now we gotta go spend time with Aragaki. Yukari, I'm sorry, you have to wait, kitten. What? So, what do you want? You want to talk to me about something? Yes. Let's go somewhere else. You hungry? Hmm. So, are you still carrying that thing around? You need to rethink this. Looks like you're not just playing errand boy this time. Sorry, but I'm not going back to school. Since it's you, I guess I'll say it. I ain't gonna live much longer. Huh? I'm getting by on meds right now, but that won't last forever. How did that happen? I didn't know my limits, and I bit off more than I could chew. This is what I deserve. This is my body we're talking about. I know it better than anyone, and I know there's nothing I can do. Dang. Here you go. Two specials. Eat up. The noodles are getting soggy. Hmm. I know it seems like I wasted your time, but it's the good memories that stay with you and get people through their struggles. But it's also the mistakes you made that haunt you forever. I gotta use what time I have left to set things straight. I don't have the luxury of doing anything else. Don't forget your promise. Oh, damn. You really don't mince your words, do you? But you know, that ain't so bad. It's way more refreshing than having someone keep quiet because they're scared of hurting my feelings. That's got to be why they depend on you so much. Aki and Kirijo are fighting with way more confidence than they had two years ago. Yeah, you're just something special. But look, if you got time to waste on me, then go spend it on someone else. Like Amada. He's still just a kid. He's way in over his head. I'm still going to do whatever I can to help. Uh but after that, I'm counting on you. I'll hold on to this. Yeah. I should have been the one to hand it in. Sorry I put that on you. You can head on outside. I'm paying today. Yo, I actually love that. Th this was an incredible scene. Thanks. Money's on the counter. Thanks. Come again. Shinji is literally like best character in the Persona verse type shit. Oh, that was actually that was actually great. Okay, I think we're about to get a new ability with Fuka. So let's go see what that's sitting on. Do you want to read it together today? All right, let's see what ability she gets. Hopefully, since she's the Oracle, I'm hoping it's something really good. And we get academics for it too, so it's two birds, one stone type shit. Oh, did you finish reading the final volume? Yes. I really focused when you were reading. I can definitely relate. When I got to the end, I was so absorbed that I almost forgot to breathe. What an amazing series. I didn't notice at first, but at some point I could suddenly just make sense of the complex setting. Isn't it weird how that works? Are you going to romance Mitsuru or Yukari? Both. 
I skipped the complicated parts. It's like magic. Oh, it really does feel that way, doesn't it? They do say advanced technology is indistinguishable from magic. Maybe going in with that mindset makes sci-fi a little less intimidating. I wish I could communicate as well as the author does in this book. Remember when I told you how I recommended a book to a classmate, but she turned me down? Knowing what to say is important, but how you say it is difficult too. A lot of you motherfuckers in chat need to listen to this life lesson, okay? There's a bunch of motherfucking Fukas running around my chat right now. Before I could tell her how fascinating the story is, I was telling her how many volumes it was and that it's written by a famous author. I don't think that kind of information is going to persuade someone to read. It'll go better next time. Thanks. Maybe I'll try talking to her again. I think I'll have a lot of good things to say about this book now. It always feels nice when someone shows an interest in something you like. Even just sharing our opinions like this is so refreshing. That's why I really want to work on how I communicate things. Because if I do that, then maybe I'll get more fun moments like this. Fuka is nodding with determination. Uh, what is it? 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 Reduces damage taken when an ally's weakness is struck. Hey, that's pretty fucking good. My God, that's pretty fucking good. Oh, look at the time. We should probably call it a night. Um, I have some other books I can recommend. If you uh, no, thank you. Your book recommendations are actually terrible. I hope you like those too. Well then. I gotta catch up to you this weekend. I'm debating if like I'm gonna take any days off or if I'm just gonna like literally no life this game. I don't know what I wanna do. I can hear people talking. Hey, there. hey did you go to the film festival during summer vacation? Oh. oh, the one at Port Island movie theater? Yeah, I watched a bunch of things. I heard they're gonna have it again next week for just one day, wanna go? On the 23rd, right? I'll pass on this one. I forgot what the theme this time was, but I remember it was all kitty. I'm two months behind? Yeah, this... I've only been playing Persona for three hours today, and I'm gonna be playing it for a lot more. <laughs> Oh shit. This is the first time we've met during the day. Let's have a chat while the opportunity presents itself. But we're enemies. That doesn't concern me. Now, let's be off. I understand one of my group has caused you some trouble. Is she in good health? It must be difficult looking after her. After all, you likely can't rein her in for very long. Or could it be you've already killed her? We don't kill people. So you're keeping her alive. Then I take it you've had to use the suppressants, as I'd expect from Kirijo's resourcefulness. And you now have someone with first-hand experience among your number as well. If you already know about the suppressants, that simplifies things. Can you imagine it? A Persona user murdered by their other half. Such is the fate of a Persona that has gone berserk. Niggas die every day, B. As you have already seen for yourself. This power of ours is not meant to be wielded by just anyone. That holds true even for those who were awakened by force. It comes at a great cost, and we can only harness it by walking the line between life and death. This power makes us who we are. And yet, you hold the ability to wield so many. The Dark Hour has graced you with its favor, almost unjustly so from our perspective. Now, I ask you, don't you think it'd be a shame for you to lose such a special power? 
It's for the sake of the world, man. You stubbornly cling to that sentiment. Do you have no intention of understanding anything? Choosing to turn a blind eye towards your own power, to the grief of the fallen, the unchosen, the unloved. Such apathy, such insolence. You trample upon everything we stand for. And worst of all, your rejection of my... You tread upon your gifts like dirt, and in doing so, reveal your own arrogance. It disgusts me. Oh, wow. I see now that nothing will change your mind. If our beliefs are at odds with each other, and neither side is willing to concede, then a battle is unavoidable. Hey, you better take your hand off that pistol, bitch. Before I have to pull out my evoker and fucking bring this persona out on your ass. What the hell? confrontation will come in our own time you have been blessed with a power greater than any other and yet you don't see its true value <sighs> such a shame right <laughs> don't bring that blick if you're not finna use it real shit I'm drenched from the rain. My whole body is shivering. Huh. Didn't quite make it, huh? According to the news, a typhoon just hit. Apparently, it's the biggest one on record. It's moving slowly, too, so it'll be gloomy for a while. Yeah, thanks to that, the school festival got canned. Well, less work for us in the end, I guess. Still sucks that we'll be stuck indoors for vacation, though. So, what you gonna do over break? Um, nothing special. I always did picture you as a guy with too much free time. What about you, Fuka? Me? The only thing I plan to do is go to the movies. Ooh, Whoops. A movie? Do you have a date? It's not like that. Wait, she got a date? Wait a minute. Noski. Oh, the girl that bullied you? Typhoon. I don't know if we'll make it. How about you, Yukatan? Still gonna have practice? Hmm? I don't know. The archery range is outside, so it's most likely canceled until the storm blows over. Yes, you did, Asim. This stupid typhoon is gonna mess up my training. You gotta be booked, right, Kurijo Senpai? I'm not sure yet. Why are you so curious about our business, Iori? Oh, me? Well, I'd be happy to- Oh, here he goes, bruh. I suspect that you will be visiting Chidori-san. Although she is in stable condition now, we still can't release her. Man, Aichan, you must be psychic. And you know what? She even told me she wants me to come. Oh, man. I can't believe she said that. So I figured I should probably check up on her. You know, with the storm and all. Mm-hmm. Junpei is so in love. I feel excited. Um, well. You don't know either, huh? Um. Oh, Amada-kun, what are your plans during the break? Oh, I'm not really doing anything in particular. Come on, you gotta be doing something. Oh, I'll probably go visit the shrine. Dude, you're a kid, not an old man. I always go to pray, though. I guess you could say I have a wish I want granted. <sighs> anyway, I'm going back to my room. I've got a lot of homework to do. Oh, okay. Just holler if you get stuck, yeah? <sighs> Maybe I should head to bed early tonight. I can't do anything? Fuck ya! 39 hours in this game, chat. Still so much left to go.
Oh? I've been waiting for you. It's been quite some time since I last summoned you in your dreams. Several seasons have come and gone since I first offered you my assistance. Now then, your persona abilities. Have you been using them wisely? Hell yeah. To be direct, I sense a great catastrophe in your future, but it would be a oh, wow. pity to lose one with such potential as yourself. Therefore, please allow oh? me to provide you with a new form of assistance. Wait, what are we unlocking? I will unlock further secrets of fusion previously unrevealed to you. I am certain that you will find this to be of great benefit. Special fusion. Oh, the. Okay, I know what these are. You must be tired. Please rest easy until we meet again. Farewell. Is it bad that I kind of preferred Evil Igor's voice in P five? Uh, I could. The thing is, is that when P five came out, a lot of Persona fans really did not like how Igor sounded in that game. But now that a lot of people started with Persona 5, now a lot of folks are having like the kind of inverse opinion. Okay, what can we do here? Spend time with Aragaki. Uh... Okay, since we actually finished Aragaki's thing, we can't actually do that. Ten thousand yen. Give me my academics. Mink, mink, that's huge. Big points. Hey, Yukari. Yukatan. Take shit. Uh, I could cook with Mitsuru. That won't really get me anything, though. Uh, watch TV with Koro. I mean, I already did that, right? Alright. Hold on. What happens if we read with Junpei? Nice uh, courage. I don't really need courage. I'd rather really get my academia up, my academia nuts up. I mean, I can do this. Oh, wait, I have to go harvest it. Should I do this or work on my academics? That's the question. This shit's been up here for like three months, by the way. Hold on, let me see. If uh, that the game at the arcade is academics, I'm gonna do that. Since I don't always get to have that option. Okay, it's charm. Okay, Shinji, let's go uh, plant some weed or something. <laughs> Omega lol. Omega dance, but gay. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I know when I finally get this game, I'm never putting it down. Honestly, I'd probably have way more. Uh. I'd probably have way more hours in this game if I didn't like force myself to stop so that way people wouldn't be so behind the streams. I forgot I ordered this cookie earlier. Good answer. Let's just hope you can maintain that enthusiasm. 
Once you start something, you gotta see it through to the end. I played P5 three times. I feel Persona 5 was not very fun on a replay, so when I tried to replay it, I gave up because I didn't really enjoy it that much. This game, though, I don't know, man. But it'll probably turn out fine. No, still at the orphanage. I learned a bunch of stuff with Aki. I'm talking too much. Let's get back to work. That should do it. This kind of work is usually easier with more people. Come help out again when you've got the time. Let's head back now and wash your hands after handling all that soil. I don't even have DLC personas. Good morning. This is Elizabeth. I am calling to inform two this time, I believe. Damn. Goodbye now. Next auto section gonna be long as hell. No thanks, Kenji. Damn, really cold? Did you got any new cool personas? Yeah, we've got a few. We're going to be doing the uh, Tartarus at some point soon, so you'll be able to see them all. We could hang out with Koromaru here. Big facts, you know that shit not true, bro. What the fuck? All right. Koromaru is people watching yet again today. I think, I don't think you were here, Big Facts, but I already ordered Yakuza 0 and Yakuza Kiwami. And I think I'm going to start playing Yakuza after I beat FF7R. Because there are two games coming out in March, but I don't know if I'm actually going to like play them like that. So I think I'm going to start Yakuza 0. Uh after ff7r and if i go as hard in ff7r that i'm going for persona i'm hoping i can have that game beat in like a week that voice. It really is i'll play life. dragon's dogma 2 and rise of ronin but i'm probably not gonna like do full streams of them especially because i really doubt people are going to want to watch them like, I'll probably put in pre-orders on Amazon or something and then play them the day they come out, but it might just be like a one-off thing. Yeah, I got blue label for Yakuza 0. I was worried when I didn't see you at the Shrine Gate, but here you are, looking better than ever. <laughs> and so well-dressed. You've become quite the fashionista, haven't you? Oh, good boy. Good boy. Do you live in the storm? Is Koromaru in good hands here? The thing about Shiba Inus is that they're so cute, but I always hear that they're such brats and such a pain to take care of. He takes care of me. Oh, is that so? I can see Yakuza ain't gonna... Dude, stop! I want to play the new Yakuza game so fucking bad. That's the whole reason why I want to go through the whole series is because the new Yakuza game looks like the best game of all time. I'm glad you found somewhere you can relax again. Aww. Oh, don't you worry about a thing. You can live wherever you choose. I have to get going. Take care now, the both of you. What's wrong, Koromaro san? I see. 
So that's what's troubling you. That woman from earlier, she offered to take Koromaru-san in at one point. You beat all the Yakuza games in like one month, right, Yagami? I feel like you started them in like January and you ran through like all of them like right before Reload came out. But at the time, he still had unfinished business to attend to. Of course, she is unaware of that fact. So in all likelihood, she may still carry the wrong impression about Koromaru-san's feelings. Oh, it's you again. Is everything all right? I can't talk about Personas or the Dark Hour. Would this happen to be about Koromaru? He had a reason. Don't worry, I understand. Sometimes you don't even need words, right? He's such a sweet, smart boy, isn't Aww. he? Aww. So really, I'm all right. But thank you for being so thoughtful. The way he's by your side. He looks just like he did when he was with the priest. Aww. He must really trust you from the bottom of his heart. Please, take good care of Koromaru. We'll always be together. Looks like Koromaru heard me. Koromaru really has been blessed with so many wonderful friends. Be sure to cherish them, okay? You'll be at that dorm from now on, won't you? <laughs> well, I'll have to visit you again then. I feel a strong sense of trust coming from Koromaru. I took an overjoyed Koromaru on a walk before going home. Oh, he's even faster now? Oh my god. He's already so fast. Are we about to get a new skill with him? All right, let's see what it is, chat. Go to the kitchen. Yeah. All right, let's go. I actually can't wait to get to the Tartarus. This is a box full of sawdust. Today, we're using that to make tempera bowls. Go ahead and take out what's in the box. It's a box of shrimp. Living, wriggling shrimp. Getting these delivered is a royal pain in the ass. So I went and got That's them just now. I'm gonna get the other Yo, Wandre, thank you for the 35 months. I appreciate that. Chat, I don't want to alarm anybody, but we're only three subs away from 15. I don't want to alarm anybody, but... <sighs> Leave it to me. Yeah, it's all you. I'll handle the first one. So pay attention and just do the same. I struggled to prep the live shrimp following Aragaki's instructions. We managed to work together to finish the tempura bowls. The taste is pretty good. Although I guess we did use good shrimp. You've gotten a lot better too. You're more comfortable with the knife and fryer now. All you gotta do now is keep practicing. Get the basics down. And just find the right way to cook the stuff you have. And that's how I was taught. Hmm. You had a great teacher. <laughs> More like a stubborn old man. A long time ago, I used to work part-time at a restaurant. The manager drilled me on how to cook. He gave me so much shit back then, but... When I think back on it now, it wasn't really a bad experience. He always used to say, learning to cook is the first step to supporting yourself. That's real. But not only that, if I didn't know how to do it myself, I wouldn't be teaching you like I am right now. I ain't gonna teach you every little thing. I can at least be here to show you how it's done. It gives me something to do, too. Aww. 
Aragaki has a genuine smile on his face. All right, what do we get? Temporarily increases attack and defense of self at the start of the battle. Wait. Oh, that's just temporarily. That's pretty good. Oh, right. Let's eat up and then put everything away. You can head back to your room once you're finished. I'll handle the cleanup. I'm going to give some to Korra Oh. Hey, I got to make Koromaru's dinner. Oh, first. look at him. Ow. Oh. You got a problem? Shinji's theurgy is my fave. Oh, in terms of like how it actually looks in the animation and shit. Oh yeah, for sure. I've got a text message. I can be. I can be. Let's see what other options we have, chat. You know, I got to keep your options open. You feel me? You can't be like, you can't be you like, you can't be like too thirsty. Like, you can't be like, you can't be like, you can't be like too thirsty. Like, tai shi, tai 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 Wait, but this is like a social event thing with Yukari, I'm pretty sure. Like, this is like a special, like, Persona 3 reload only. I, the fact that they added these is, like, really cool. Don't get me wrong. Like, I like it. But at the same time, it's kind of fucking up my social links. <laughs> like, I'm not playing optimally because I keep do I keep wanting to see the new stuff they added to reload. Looks like Yukari wants to hang out. Wow, what a concert. It feels good to sing as loud as you can, doesn't it? Plus, your song choices are pretty unique, Nagakun. Oh. oh, speaking of music, what do you usually listen to? Uh, some J-pop shit, you know what I'm saying? Look, huh? huh? I'm a canine at heart, I'm a dog. I don't listen to that bullshit. Hey, who's your favorite band? These days I've been super into this one that did a song for a popular drama. Oh, sorry, I got a little too excited about it. I don't think this is a Persona 3 Reload uh, exclusive cutscene. I ran out of hand powder. Okay. It was probably Ken, actually. Because there was one here. Spent time with Amada, studied in your room, went on a walk. Wait, spent time with Amada. That means he has a uh, event, I think. Yukari got me in a chokehold. Yukari. I think Yukari is the best lover's uh, Arcana character. Sound like he's doing something in his room. <gasps> Who's the... Ow! Senpai? Uh, I heard some noise. What about On? I have news for you, buddy. I knocked over some stuff while I was. If you take On's character from Persona Five and fuse it with all of the other spinoffs, then she gets close to Yukari. But Yukari gets all that done in one game. In original P Five, I don't think On is that good. I guess sound travels really well around here. I'll be more careful. But they both wash okay, Yukiko. Then. Yukiko is actually the fucking worst. Um, Senpai? Actually, there is something I'd like to talk about. Will you come in? Yukiko isn't lovers? Wait, who's lovers? Oh, it's Ra Rise. I almost called her Rise. So For, do, but doesn't Yukiko seem like she's supposed to be lovers? Which one is Yukiko again? Whatever Yukiko is, she's ass. I actually have a favor to ask of you. You see, I have a pet hamster. Oh, priestess. I got him when I was living with my mom, and he's been with me ever since. W hamster. So I decided to bring him here. If, for some reason, I don't make it back here in the future, then this little guy will be all alone. Aww. 
Could you help look after him if that happens? <laughs> that won't happen. Of course. I have you guys with me, so I won't go down easily. But you never know, right? It was the same with my mom. Everything happened so suddenly. So please. I can even provide a little something as thanks. I'll give you all my allowance and the rest of my New Year's money. And I'll give you all the comics here. Aww. You want. Aww. Hypothetically speaking. Okay. That works for me. Well, aren't you the lucky one? But when that happens, you better listen to him, okay? What's his name? Uh, his name, it's Hamburger. Aye, bruh. Is that your favorite food? My favorite would be omelet rice, but hamburgers are a close second. I'm not gonna lie, I love hamburgers. The night he came home with me, we had hamburgers for dinner. So that's why. Anyways, thank you so much. That's a big relief. There's not much time left now. Aww. Sorry again for the disturbance. Ken is actually so much better in this game. To everyone else for me, it's getting late, so I'm going to bed soon. Um, actually, can I ask you one more thing? Everyone in this dorm is so kind. They always come up to me for a casual chat, and they treat me like a normal person. Sure, there were plenty of adults who showed concern for me, but I feel like the people here are a little different and you came to check in on me again today but why why does everyone here care about what happens to me dang because i know how it feels oh right your parents i'm sorry i shouldn't have said that i guess that was a weird question wasn't it sorry don't mind me but maybe I should have asked sooner. I don't know if I'll be able to fully repay you for your kindness, but I'll do my best. Okay then. Good night. Senpai! I'm really glad you came. Thank you. And I'm sorry. I won't let you down. I think people hated Ken as well because of the Fem C route. I don't think that's really it. I think most people hated Ken because he's a kid and he behaves like a kid. And then he also does something later on in the game that we'll see uh, that a lot of people hate him for. <clears throat> I think that's the biggest reason. I've been feeling a lot more like fall ever since the typhoon. Oh, it's been feeling a lot more like fall ever since the typhoon passed. I really hope the fighting ends before winter comes. I'm sure it will. I mean, when I lie to her fucking face. That's why. Hey, baddie. How you doing, mama? How you doing, mama? Tasty stinky. Me and Yukari. Your leader will be <clears throat> Okay, let's hurry up and get this over with. These two bums? Roger that. Got it. Hmm, I guess this was the photography club's display. Look, I got a pretty good picture of you. Whoa, the guy who took first looks pretty suntan. That's Hayase. He's crazy fast. Of course, it's only a matter of time until I take him down. <laughs> You've already got him beat in the sweaty department. I swear, I've never seen you without your gym clothes. Then again, yeah, you're the smart one here. 
Just walking around is enough to work up a sweat these days. Hey, you guys can jabber all you want, but at least keep things moving. At this rate, we'll be here all day. Uh, sorry, Takeba. My bad. Hey, what's got you all worked up? Nothing. Jeez. Yo, I brought the tools and stuff. The nail puller, tape, and, uh... If you require a drill, I have one installed. <laughs> cool. Thanks, guys. Wait, hang on. Where's the bubble wrap, Iori? Bubble wrap? Oh, right. We gotta pack stuff up. Uh... Good call, man. You should go get it. You know where they keep that stuff, right? Well, yeah, but you're the one who forgot to grab it. Oh. Are you sure you don't want to go? Place is like a paradise, you know? Some fine chicas there, be just your type. Uh, what? No way. Are you serious? Give me the details, man. Oh my god. Ahem. I believe I asked you all to hurry it up so we could go home. Yukari's so, spitting, actually. Uh, sorry, Yukitan. Man, talk about an ace directive. I heard that. Jeez, how stupid can you be? Junpei? More like stupid. Really? Is that a... Two people came up with that? I'm getting deja vu. <laughs> I'm, I'll go to the supply room later. Still, it's a real shame the culture festival fell through. There were so many cool events I was looking forward to, like the stand-up comedy duos. They said it was going to be open mic, so I was planning on trying it out. Kenji, trust me, you would not have done it well. With who? You. Hmm. Wait, me? You're going to just push me on stage without even saying anything? I'm just messing with you. It was actually Miyamoto. Who, me? Hell no. Another joke. Chill out, guys. Yeah, you would have bombed. Uh, nah, I'm good. What? You too? You all suck. We finish our cleaning with no further issues. Hello, Yukari. There's nothing in my way, right? Right? You fucked it up? I don't give a fuck. Rewind? You want me to rewind so I can hear Kenji make jokes, bro? Are you serious? Or do you need the social links at a certain level to even get that? Because this nigga's only level one. Something else happens. Oh my fucking god. Hold on, I'm gonna pause the recording. Alright, I rewind it. If this shit doesn't work, I'm gonna kill everybody in my chat and then myself. Now that's the spirit. Why don't we show these guys what we've got? <clears throat> Hello out there, everyone. We're the famous comedy duo, Kenji Tomachika. Uh where's my name, bitch ass nigga? Ooh, nice and snappy. You're pretty good. Man, I can't wait for the culture festival. It's gonna be awesome, huh? It's already over, dummy. What? You're giving up already? All you gotta do is sleep like 360 more times and bam, culture festival. You know what they say? Early to bed, early to rise. Makes you healthy or is it lies? There you go. We got a top quality one this time. Kind of depressing, though. Hey, speaking of jokes, here's a good one. This is what I rewinded for? <laughs> when your key isn't working. Keep trying. That's the lamest joke I've heard in years. Guess that's the best Gecko Khan has to offer. Well, I thought that was a bar. Hmm, not bad, considering we didn't rehearse this at all. Man, we would have been great. All right, break it up, you guys. Seriously, I take my eyes off you for one second. Speaking of things that would have been great, you missed out on your chance to be a maid, Takeba-san. Huh? Oh, 
So word got out about that. I for one am fine with missing that opportunity. And a lot of guys were real disappointed. Did you guys make me rewind to see Yukari in a maid outfit? You are not that horny. Why are they disappointed? The maids are there to help at the cafe, right? No, okay. Alright, well, let's let it cook, chat. Let's let it cook. Mainly Junpei. Oh. What are you looking at me for? What did I do? Junpei san. Oh, come on. You too, I chan. What the fuck is gonna happen? Oh, hey, Yuko. Oh, Nishiwaki-san. What's up? You know those tents out on the field? Is it cool if we put them away in the archery club room? Oh, yeah, that's fine. Actually, don't worry about it. The archery team can take care of it later. Please, it's no biggie. Our class is in charge of cleaning up the grounds anyway. We'll go ahead and take care of it. Thanks. Oh. Are you feeling better? You had a fever, right? Not in front of my other bitches. I heard you were stuck in bed the whole break. You sure you're okay? You go. Just look at him. He's fine. I guess you have a point. Well, I'm happy to see that. Wait, you're here too, cause? Better not be slacking off. An ox like you has got a point. Why are you guys spamming Oge? Shut up. Is the time you got back to the grounds? Hey, I haven't seen him in a while. So I think we deserve some time together. Oh. Right? Um. You deserve some time together? Um. Right. Uh, Yukari. Um. Baby girl, like, it's not what it looked like type shit. Um. Dude. Hey. Uh. Right. You guys make me you guys made me reset. So that way I could lose all my bitches. So that way I would fumble all my bitches. Um if you happen to have any duct tape left, may I borrow some? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's you. I'm so glad you're here. I'm actually in charge of the classroom next door, and we've run out of tape. I was nervous coming over here, since the upperclassmen were in charge of this room. But I feel a lot better seeing you here. Um... <sighs> we just friends, like... Um, I saw Kirijo-senpai a moment ago, and she said you were, um... Right. Bedridden with a cold? You shouldn't overstrain yourself. If you're not feeling well, perhaps you should take some time off from your student council. Uh, I'm right. You'll be a little lonely no longer uh, being able to walk home together. Shut, shut the fuck up, Jihiro! Shut the fuck up! Huh? Huh? Wait, what do you mean by... Um... What exactly is your... Junpei, like yes, Junpei, help me. Someone's gonna get hurt if we don't fix it right now. Like right now. Yukitan, come on and give me a hand. Uh, keep it steady on one side so I can take it down. Ah, uh, Junpei is literally the best character in the video game. Uh, yeah, gotcha. Junpei is literally the greatest character in video game fucking history. So, uh, what were we talking about again? Um. Uh, oh yeah. Uh, man, I almost forgot. There's something important the team needs to know. Hey, you're the manager. Kaz! My goat! Huh? Wait a minute! So I want you to tell them for our next practice. Legacy uh, save! No towels a lot. Huh? No towels? Wouldn't that get in the way of practice? And why is this coming up now? Just go tell them. It's a special training technique. Yo, they just saved my whole legacy, bro. like we're all out of duct tape here i guess you'd have to go to another classroom for that i mean you guys need it now right 
Okay. Alright. Alright. You alright, white boy. Wait, I'm also white. Actually, we're <laughs> Japanese. <laughs> It's a good thing the culture festival was canceled. Ah, uh, yeah, it is. Well, no matter who you pick to go with. Hmm. Um, I guess don't don't worry about that. Don't worry about that, I guess. <clears throat> don't worry about that, I guess. Hey, you know what? Y'all are okay. You know what? Kenji, Kaz, y'all are all right, bro. Y'all my homies. But unfortunately, I need to go add another one to the harem. So I'll talk to y'all later, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Tell you shit. Like, I'll talk to y'all another time, tell you shit. Anyways, bro, y'all have a good fucking day. Thank y'all for looking out for me. I'm never hanging out with y'all so long as there's a woman available. So, y'all feel what I'm saying? Like, it just is what it is, boys. I gotta do what I gotta do, bro. I'm a canine at heart. I'm a dog, tell you shit. You feel what I'm saying? Uh, we're going, we going to rank three, boys. We're going to rank three. I'm not gonna lie. I almost banned my chats. I thought they made me fumble all my, uh, all my women's. And that shit would have not been poggers. Imagine you needed the men to have high social links so they wouldn't help you. That would have been very unfortunate. Wait, this is the same kid that ran away from the dog. Yeah, he sells us narcotics. He's definitely trustworthy. Whew, what a relief. I'm glad he was able to contact the parents. What were they thinking leaving that poor kid all alone? Stuff like that really makes me upset. But I guess my own mom's no different. Damn. What makes you say that, kitten? Why do you want to know? I'm trying to get you to fall in love with me so that way I can uh, craft a level 10 Lover's Arcana persona. Sorry, I didn't mean to poke fun at you. Remember what I told you before? How my mom and I aren't very close? Well, if you ask me what kind of parent she is, I'd say a terrible one. Hold on, mommy issues? She wasn't always like that, though. After what happened to dad, she totally changed. She's probably living with one of her boyfriends somewhere. Oh, wow. Honestly, I'd rather not know. Anyway, I'm done talking about this, okay? Uh, could we keep this between you and me? You're the only one I've told. How about we keep it between me, you, and a couple hundred people watching on Twitch right now? And then a couple hundred people that'll watch this later on YouTube. How about it? How about it? Take a dick, I'm on chat. Sorry, I'm not <clears throat> for karaoke anymore. Let's go home. I parted with Yukari and went back to the dorm. Oh, welcome back. Nagasan, do you think we could head to Tartarus tonight? Um, no. Sorry, Lojit. Unacceptable. Okay, uh, let's see. Is this gonna be academics day? I don't think it is. It is charm day. Right. Uh, I can't read with Fuka because you don't really get anything off of that. And we can't harvest the things yet. What do you get for playing with Koromaru? Sorry, boy. I can't waste any time. Yeah. 
Oh, we can still do this. So we don't have as much crap to deal with up here. There aren't as many weeds or pests on the roof. And no moles or other critters that'll dig our plants up. Still gotta watch out though. Some hungry asshole might try to help himself to the whole crop. Yeah, uh if you're referring to Japanese people, you don't use that uh you don't spell it that way, because that is actually uh like uh, I'm pretty sure that's like a slur, actually. Like JP or JPN is like the proper way to say that. You don't say that because that's a slur. <clears throat> They're getting executed. Didn't know you were so hot blooded. Type shit. Most of us here are decent and mature enough that we'd ask before doing something like that. With one exception. I mentioned I did a bit of gardening back at the orphanage, right? If someone sneaks a bite, it's no big deal. But this one time, some older kids stole our whole crop. Aki got so pissed when that happened. He went after them all by himself. Even though they were twice as tall as he was. And then again, that's probably not much different from how he is now. He hasn't changed at all. Compare that to these guys. Growing bigger every day. This should be good for today. You can head on back. I'll stay and finish up. Bro came back into the chat and said, Sorry, in my country, we don't have slurs. You're the only pussies. Like, whoa, you're so hardcore. Like, you, you say slurs, bro. Like, you're so cool. Make sure that's a perma, by the way. I don't want the, I don't want that guy back here. By the way. Is it just me, or are there a lot more cases where people lose consciousness recently? Mm. It's all over the news again, too. The whole thing makes me uncomfortable. What if it ha starts happening all over the world? What? Don't say stuff like that. Type shit. Okay, who can we hang out with? Oh, Fuka. Oh wait, what's her social link? Okay, we gotta get a priestess persona. Uh, give me un segundo. Let's go. All right, this video is already really long. This is about to be four hours long. So I'm thinking that when I start doing the, the Tartarus, I'm just going to end this episode off there. Because this shit's already gonna be long as fuck. Registering, I see. Is overriding acceptable registered? Yes, mama. My fault. I priestess. So far. So you'll be summoning me to be your inner strength. Make it six? Well. Um, I don't think so. The animations are so nice. Yeah, it's the best game of all time. Um, Gecko Con. I never felt like Dino 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 Dino. Alright, let's go, Fuki chan. Oh, wait, I gotta pull up her social link guide. Ah, ah, ah. I made another bento. Would you mind trying some of it? Oh man, this shit about to taste ass. Or at the very least, it, it can't be any worse than last time, right? Judging by appearances, it does look like she's improved. I'll give it a try. Oh, a kitty cat! Oh, he's so cute. I did hear there were lots of strays around here. 
He's looking at the bento box. I wonder if he's hungry. Maybe I should give him some food. You finna kill that cat, bro. Uh, sure. Okay, then. Oh, wait. Is there anything in here cats can't eat? Hmm. Well, if it's just flavored rice, it should be okay. Here you go, kitty. Come on, Fuka. It does have some bitterness. What? Yes. Can you do anything right? It struck a good nutritional balance, though. I know nutrition. <laughs> the cat <laughs> after eating. <laughs> That's a funny emo. I can't let you eat this. She said I can't in good hospital. <laughs> oh shit. Um <laughs> Maybe we can use it in a battle. Hey, they'll stop after they chase your shit. I'm so hopeless. I just wanted to do something. <laughs> I really went out to there aren't many chances to eat homemade food when you live in the dorm. So I thought it would be nice <laughs> for everyone. But she trying to sorry. she trying to get a triple kill, quadra kill, penta kill. I can tell Fuka is being considerate of me. It seems we've grown closer. She's doing the best she can. You, what is that? What does that matter, right? Like, let's say, for example, I hijacked a plane and I'm trying to fly the plane to safety, right? But then I fucking crash into the ground, killing everybody on board. You wouldn't say, well, he did try his best. Like, I still killed everyone. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, what? Can we be for real? I don't think I can do it doesn't matter if you try so hard. You know? Sure thing. You, nigga, you stole the plane. It's different. She can't cook. And she's trying to cook and have other people eat it. No one told her to cook. No one asked her to cook. Maybe she should stay away from the kitchen. I'm going to keep working at it. It'd be one thing if we were like, hey, Fuka, can you cook for us? And then she fucking killed us. But she was like, hey, guys, let me in the kitchen. And then killed us all. She's trying to learn, man. Okay, and I'm trying to learn how to fly a plane. <laughs> so what the fuck is the problem? <laughs> I'm more of a hands-on learner. Go to school? Guess what? She can go to culinary school. <laughs> I don't see why I'm the bad guy here. <laughs> why am I still getting hate? Uh, I can cook with Yukari, which I don't really need to do that. Read with Igis. I'm definitely trying to read with Igis. Also, I feel like, I feel like in order for you to like cook something and have it be like so bad, it can get somebody sick. I think you are incompetent beyond repair. Like, literally, if you just follow instructions, it is impossible to fuck up so bad that you make somebody sick. That reminds me. I was reading this book during class once. One of our classmates saw and said to me, Wow, I'm surprised. So, you're the type to talk with your fists. What exactly do I look like to everyone else? Bad as hell. A cute girl type of shit I'm on. Cute. Type of shit I'm on. Understand. That term is used to describe small animals. Are you saying that I'm also being <laughs> Take this cursor raw. Okay. I am an anti-shadow weapon, but I don't seem to be regarded as such. I must correct this problem at once. If it is not addressed, 
It could negatively impact my ability to carry out my duties. Once I finish reading, I will start thinking of a solution. During combat, the mental states of both sides play a significant role in the outcome. <clears throat> I want my presence to strike fear in the hearts of my enemies, but galvanize my allies as well. Galvanize? What can I do to convey that kind of impression? Ideally, it would be something to encourage people to depend on me. Maybe I can find some tips in this book. After seeing Afro cook, I understood that some people just don't have the knack to survive. Jesus, it's not that bad. I think this is enough reading for now. We should return to our rooms. Let's get on. Okay, chat, just a few more days until the full moon. Everybody knows. Yucatan! Please shit on my chest. All the hate came from an old sprite? No, maybe Fuka is just relatively boring. I don't think our bond will grow, you fucking bitch. Will my bond grow with f f f f Fuka? Oh my god, of course it will. Remember how I told you I wanted to improve my cooking? Well, I've been trying a lot since then. What up, Zagard? get the taste right. I still don't have a feel for how much salt to add. How do you do it? Uh, just a dash or two. You can't tell me this bitch isn't stupid as fuck. <laughs> I've just been pouring it in slowly. I'll try and remember that. <laughs> <laughs> to tell you the truth, but I hijack one plane and I'm the bad guy. I, really like. <laughs> I don't think I'll be able to do that for a while. <laughs> Maybe cooking just isn't for me. <laughs> oh, sorry. I know you're just trying to help me, and all I'm doing is being negative. Just take it slow. My Thank fucking you. back itch. That really means a lot to me. I've never had someone be so supportive of me like this before. I actually have quite a lot of trouble staying optimistic about things. I see why. In my head, I always imagine something going horribly wrong. That's why sometimes I feel like giving up when I'm cooking. I feel like the consequences of hijacking a plane outweighs the consequences of shit food. Shit food can literally kill you. Hijacking a plane doesn't always necessarily kill you. W, body. Around you or the rest of the team, I never think like that. You've all given me so much confidence in myself. So in fact, I would I'm say this. To be a member of C's. I would say this. Me personally, I have a better chance of surviving a plane hijacking than eating bad food. Let me speak on it. That's why I want to show you all my gratitude. Like, here's the thing. A plane can land. But, like, if I sprinkle rat poison in your hamburger, you die 100 times out of 100. So, like... Like, what's the problem? But in that case, I can't really read while cooking. I wouldn't want to get the pages dirty. Uh, I'll help you find something. Oh, you don't mind? But, um, How many people put rat poison in food? Uh, crazy. You know your dinner? It tasted a little weird today, didn't it? It's not a big deal or anything, but... Bon appetit. I have 
to go. Um, the hair dryer burned out, so I was planning on fixing it. But I was hoping to get it done before Yukari-chan and the others got back. Sorry, do you mind if we up the pace on the way back? Right! Oh, you're back. Oh, you're back. I just came inside my pants. I'm going to give Fuka a chance this playthrough. I Look, I like Fuka a lot more in this playthrough than I uh, have previously, of course. The only vegetables I ever see at the store are plain old ordinary ones. You know those fancy veggies only people like Karijo Senpai would eat? If we could grow something like that... If you think I'm bad to Fuka now, that original playthrough, y'all would have been in hell. You know what you're doing? Nope, not even a little. <laughs> Tried growing some morning glories once. Didn't think they'd die so fast. But you're pretty good with your hands, so I'll let you handle it. Sound good? Well, we should probably get to work before we get ahead of ourselves. Uh, this is getting really rough on my back. Yeah, my hands are all caked in dirt. I'm glad I wasn't here for the original playthrough because Agent 47 would have been outside your window. Uh, Agent 47 would agree with me, I fear. How I could deal with all this on my own, so let's do this again, okay? Fuka is definitely much better in this game. And like, like, I, like I've always said, like, no memes. Like, Fuka was never really bad. She was just dog shit. <laughs> nah, Fuka was like... Uh, so I'll tell you why Fuka got so much shit back in the day. Like, realistically, I was just upset with myself. Like, I had a lot of personal issues going on type shit. And I needed somebody to, like, put all that negative emotion out on. So, like, Fuka was just the target of that. Akinari. But, like, it's like, like I've said before... I just generally am really annoyed at, like, the really shy, timid, like, eh, fucking, like, useless type of character. Like, like, I really hate that character archetype. She's trying not to be useless. Who cares? She's still useless. I never went to sleep. I thought I'd be fine since I've lost sleep from the pain and anxiety of my illness before. But I suppose I'm not doing my health any favors. She's like Hinata, but low key better. So Hinata pulled up on pain. You need to listen to your body. Or not Hinata. Or, Fuka pulled up on pain rather, I should have said. Apologize. It's been so long since anyone told me off or anything. I came out here because I was hoping to find you. I only have so much time left, you know. Do you remember when I said I like reading heartwarming stories? There are as many stories as there are stars in the sky, but I don't think any of them are what I'm looking for. The problem is. None of those stories were written for people like me. I guess I'm just being selfish. Just like I am with you, too. Aww. You're always coming to visit me, keeping me company. And Cole, I'm about to body you after this scene, by the way. How much of your valuable time have you spent with me? I don't deserve it. You're spoiling me. That's why I like you so much, though. Scream. 
scrimp is going to bed? That's not my grinder. Sorry, I was in such a good mood that I overexerted myself. I'd like to see you again sometime. Okay, back to what Code said. Code said that re that archetype is the reason why he can't stand Futaba. Let's take a look at the reasons why Futaba is socially awkward and trying not to be useless and stuff like that versus Fuka, okay? Futaba, mother was murdered in front of her as part of a larger conspiracy that uh, she had no control over and she was traumatized from it and thus uh, she locked herself away in her room and avoided all social interactions because of her trauma. Fuka is worthless because she can't fucking read a cookbook. <laughs> like, okay. Like, has Fuka ever, like, gone through any struggle in her life? Like, I'll literally wait. Oof. Wants to go for a walk. Sonata can come with us. Um... I kind of want to get my academia up, but I can chill with Akihiko. Whew. Keeping up with your running pace makes for great training. When I was a kid, Fuka was relentlessly bullied in the beginning of the game. So is everybody. Who cares? I was bullied at the beginning of the game. You don't see me, or in the beginning of my life, you don't see me trying to fucking poison all my friends with toxic food. But we weren't allowed to have pets at the orphanage. Maybe it's because Shinji came back. You will see me hijacking a plane, however. I've been thinking about the past a lot recently. Hey, welcome back. Does this guy have something in his mouth? A power incense. Didn't know they had stuff like this at the shrine. <laughs> Maybe we should try looking for some next time. Anyway, it's time we start heading back. Let's go for a run again sometime, Koromaru. Hello, Pharos. I'm sure I don't have to tell you this, but there's only one more week until the full moon. I hope nothing serious happens. But you can never be sure what the future holds. Be careful out there, okay? Remember, I'm always looking out for you. We'll meet again. It is hilarious that, like, retaliating against Fuka, who is like, I feel like like almost unanimous not even unanimous like it's almost like irrefutable that she is just one of the weaker characters in the persona main cast and like trying to like drag down what is probably one of the best characters in the persona main cast is like kind of crazy By the way. someone in my neighborhood actually has those symptoms yeah, exactly. there are a few in mine too i'm scared they said on TV that it's not contagious, but I feel like it's a sign at the end of the road. Don't joke like that. The end of the world? There's no way. We skipping. Come on. I have so much left to go for the academics, though. I've been doing a lot of the side stuff, so I haven't been even getting up my bullshit. I might grow f closer with her soon. I'm not going to lie. I would low-key rather waste time getting Yukari's social link to go up next time then hang out with Fuka again. What rank is she? She's three. 
Alright, whatever. I think the Fuka shit is mainly just jokes, but I do think she is the most boring cast member for sure. Like, I don't dislike her. Like, I, she kind of like, she's kind of like, like, I love to bully her. She's just mad bullyable, but I don't hate her. Fuka over Futaba. Yeah, you only spelled one of their names correctly. Bodied by facts and logic. Um. No, that's not true at all. I mean, everyone in our group works hard. Fuka versus Yukiko, who's more boring? I think Yukiko has like a little bit more to some of her story bullshit than Fuka, but I still would say Yukiko still somehow finds a way to be more boring than Fuka. Yukiko is the most boring, bland character ever put in a video game. And beyond that, I think you all have something that you're good at. Not me. I mean, I guess I'm sort of good with machines, but that's it. It's honestly not worth mentioning. Really, I just happen to like them. It's not exactly something worth boasting about. When I was little, I remember my dad's hobby was to work on complicated sound equipment. Wait, that's just like me. Is Fuka my daughter? No wonder I never mind. Headphones that only played sound on one side. I've always loved watching him work on those things. That's probably why I was drawn to working with machines in the first place. But I don't think that would be very useful to repay everyone's kindness. Plus, if we do ever have any technical needs, like when we're fighting, then we've always got the Kirijo group's support. Not to mention that I'm kind of embarrassed about it all. I mean, it's not a very feminine... Wait, she's into audio shit? Perhaps I've judged you too harshly. Yeah, you kind of yapping. Easy talking to you. I feel like you stop me from being so negative all the time. Actually, I might owe a lot to you in that sense. Rank four, hooray! Oh, it's getting late. Sorry, I didn't mean to talk so much. Let's go home. Yeah, don't make a habit out of it, please. Thank you. One more week. Save 40 hours in. You know, a lot of games are done by 40 hours. We're not even halfway through just yet. stems and roots laying around after harvesting the crops my birthday in game happy birthday code you can't replant anything until you do that now i would say we're about halfway through the game honestly we might even be a little bit more than halfway through unless i'm forgetting how long this game is mm, got it i'm glad you pick up one stuff i'm trying to think of what other major there's still quite a bit quite a lot of major events that have to happen but I think they happen like quite quickly from here on out. We started this on a whim, but it's worth it every now and then. Even someone like me can, well, 
me we put this. Growing something once you see the result of your labor. So you feel like you built it with your own hand. Aww. This life cycle ends once you eat it, though. Mm. We still have our memories. That's so damn cheesy. Oh. You know, maybe you're right. That I'd forgotten all about gardening as a kid. Even if someone disappears, maybe they can still leave something behind. Yeah. Nothing. Just talking to myself. Guess that ain't really like me. Aragaki seems to have realized something through tending the garden. Ah, uh, what does he get? Increases all stats at the start of the battle. <laughs> Yo, this nigga is crazy. Break time's over. I don't care. I'm using Shinji. Put him on the team. All right. That just about does it. Thanks for your help. If you ever do this again, I'll join you. Time to head back. This game wants you to use Shinji so bad. Yeah, they do. Okay, we have another thing with uh, Koro. With the clock level up stuff, it's not a bad idea. Yeah, that's why I'm more open to doing it. Because you have the little clock thing. So, it makes it like, there's a really good addition to the game. Well, hello there. It's the inseparable duo. Hello, gentlewoman. <laughs> Waved you. Yes. Aww. Oh, my gift is going to get cold. Look, I brought you some takoyaki today. It's Octopia's specialty. Taco free takoyaki for dogs. There's one for people too. So enjoy them together, okay? Say that. The woman left the takoyaki and walked off. Oh shit, is that his op? It's the stray dog that chased that boy around the other day. He looks like he's in bad shape. Aww, give him some takoyaki. Let's share some. Huh? Now that I look a little closer, I see he has a collar. Oh? Mm. Let's find his owner. I decided to take the stray dog to the police station. Uh, it doesn't look like anyone's reported him missing yet. So, you guys are helping stray dogs now too? Aren't you spreading yourselves a bit too thin? Nah, we're not like them fuck ass phantom thieves that only go into the metaverse and shit like that. Like we actually out here grinding type shit. Change it all, happy boy. He's always felt the need to be this town's watchdog. Maybe he got it from the priest. And now that he's with you, he's more righteous than ever, isn't he? Anyway, hang on a minute. No answer. <sighs> Hello, this is Officer Kurosawa from the Tatsumi East Police Station. Okay. Written on the collar. Yes, no one answered, so I called you instead. Yes, that's right. A brown, medium-sized dog. I see. All right, I'll see you then. Ooh. Me and Koromaru had the same journey. We've managed to identify the owner. However, they're in the hospital. After falling to apathy syndrome. Oh. What will happen to the dog? Don't worry. The owner's family will take the dog in. Cases like this one have been on the rise. 
Pets are being abandoned because their owners are falling prey to apathy syndrome. And to survive, the pets have no choice but to take to the streets. That's actually like a really smart thing to write. You know, because like you probably wouldn't think of like, okay, what well, happens to people's pets? You know, but that's a real thing that would happen. I don't know the whole picture, but that much I'm certain about. I'm gonna get back to work now. Watch yourselves on your way home, all right? Koro. Koromaru seems sad. Is he thinking about the dog or the people who were harmed? We're the only ones who can change this situation. Let's do everything we can. Oh, he tweaking. Let's go. I can feel a sense of determination from Koromaru. This game literally just made every character better. Welcome back. Hello, Fuka. Oh, I forgot about those things. It looks like Junpei's room. Hey, yo, why is she in Junpei's room? This way, officer. At the hey. time I noticed the door was halfway open. Oh, this is what he went missing? Like this. I've left the place untouched as you requested. Hmm. Whose room is this? Junpei Iori, a second year student. I've been trying to reach him on his cell phone. Yeah, this is when he, he went missing. responded in the last half hour. <sighs> it was careless of me to let my guard down. The storm was attacked once in the past. Perhaps Iori himself is at fault here. However, if harm has fallen upon him as head of seas, I am accountable. I hate to say it, Kirijo-san, but he most likely. Huh? Kirijo-san, by? Huh? What the hell? Kurosawa-san? What's going on here? Iori? Where were you? I've been trying to get a hold of you. Huh? Oh, uh, it was hot, and the AC was busted, so I went to the manga cafe, but I fell asleep. Well, I'm just glad you're safe. So if it wasn't an attack, then it must have been theft. Why would the burglar target this room? <laughs> burglar? What else could it be? Someone clearly ransacked the place looking for something, vandalizing a school dorm. When I find out who did this, I'll see to it that they face a swift execution. Well, son, sounds like you've got a death sentence. How about it, Iori? Was this room really vandalized? Ah, uh, well, this is how my room always looks? W what? But, I mean, you can't possibly live like this, can you? Don't show her my room, bro. It was open. Oh, that? I was just airing the place out while I was gone. No one we don't know ever comes around, so... Huh. I think this case is closed. May I get back to my duties now, young lady? Oh, uh, yes. I'm sorry you had to witness something so disgraceful. I apologize for all this. It seems I grew up more sheltered than I realized. You're not even gonna yell at me? And what's the deal with calling the cops over a messy room anyway? What the hell did I do to deserve this? Hey, wait. I drew that worst luck fortune on the way back. Yeah. That might be it, bro. That might be it. All right, we got another one.
It looks like Fuka's room. Hmm. I wonder if I should have gone for the one piece suit instead. These halter top bikinis look almost like underwear. It feels a little weird to have my belly button exposed. Now that I think about it, this is the first time I've chosen my own swimsuit, but there wasn't much of a selection for the one pieces. Hmm. I wonder if I should ask Yukari-chan again what she thinks. Although, I don't really exercise, so I probably wouldn't look very good standing next to her. Oh, right! I have just the thing! The low-frequency waist slimmer pad I bought from Tanaka's TV show! It said online it was very effective for its price, so maybe it could do some help before the trip. Now let's see. How do I turn Are you dead ass? Uh, no, this <laughs> it tickles. <laughs> what do I do? <laughs> I promise you this is not the game I love, bro. <laughs> Bro, Mitsuru is probably like, ah, I see you got the wand out today. That's y'all go. That's all I'm saying, chat. That's y'all go right there. That's who y'all was going to war for. That's who y'all was defending. That's y'all go. But oh, damn it! I still can't stop thinking about what happened in Yakushima. You're telling me I can't carry a conversation any better than Junpei? How can I be on the same level as that idiot and his lady? Oh, wow. Lines? Are you able to make others laugh with a well-timed joke? Well, no specific examples come to mind, but I think I at least do that much. Careful. Making others laugh and being laughed at are two entirely different things. When people speak to you, do you tend to respond with pure logic and reason? This is a common mistake among inarticulate men. <laughs> Try to consider what the other party is feeling first. <sighs> oh, damn it. I guess they've got a point. Try practicing by imagining you're asking a female friend or colleague to your favorite store. Remember, it's important to smile and have a sense of humor. Huh. Um, hey there. Uh, what great timing to see you here. Nice one. I'm going to uh, Umiushi. <laughs> Wanna come with? Oh, humor. Uh, humor. Y you know the beef bowl place? Uh, hey, m maybe we could meet up there, huh? M get it? <laughs> <laughs> what am I, the chairman? Screw this. This is your go? Hey, bro, your go was using a fucking $5,000 sex toy she ordered from QVC while Meets were trying to talk to her. 
I feel like it's some differences here. It's the lounge. Aragaki and Koromaru are watching TV. You two can follow along on page 39 of this month's issue. Today we're making spicy pepper pasta. It's a great dish to keep your energy up in the summer heat. The key ingredient is the manganji pepper. Remember to remove the seeds first. After that, we'll prepare some kombu soup stock. You'll need a pasta cooker about this size and... <laughs> Fuka needs this show. <laughs> we even have one of those here. That's real. It's still pretty hot. It requires excess energy to maintain an appropriate external temperature. <laughs> Shit. We have returned. We're home, Koro-chan. Oh, shh. We should be quiet. It looks like Aragaki Senpai's asleep. He says Aragaki san is not asleep. Dang, El Snitch. Huh? Huh. Senpai's magazine. It's the monthly guide to the family cooking show. Does Aragaki Senpai enjoy cooking shows? I didn't even know this month's issue was out. Aragaki san frequently watches programs like Koro! It's okay, I guess. Come on, let's go. Okay, actually W Fuka. Actually W Fuka. Fuka knew that he didn't want them to know that, so he like so she diffused the situation to make it less awkward. Actually, W Fuka. Rare Fuka W moment right there. Damn. Forgot you can understand dogs. Oh, don't sweat it. It ain't your fault. Aww. Don't worry, Koro chan. Next time, I'll make you something too. <laughs> The recording ends here. Dang, another new... There was just one today, too, right? So, Oh, shit, that's my room. I can see myself sleeping in bed. Door unlocked in 92 seconds. My time has improved. Um... Um, right... Surface body temperature reads 36.2 degrees Celsius. No fever. At this rate, he should make a full recovery by morning. The pillow I prepared in the freezer will not be necessary. I cannot stay too long, or Yukari-san will reprimand me again. That's my bestie! Leo Lamar, thank you for the prime for five months. Prime sub for my goat. Hey, thank you, brother. I appreciate that. Welcome back. Chat, I don't want to alarm anybody, but we're only two subs away from 15. Hooray! There are still four hours and 12 minutes until sunrise. I should be safe as long as I sneak out before morning. She just watching me sleep? I will keep watch over him for a little longer. The recording ends here. Right. I've gotten used to walking around without my bathrobe lately. Not a very good habit to fall into. Well, I'm away from home, so it's no big deal, I suppose. 
This fashion magazine. I thought I'd take a look after I saw Takeba purchasing one. 256 snazzy looks to knock the socks off of your BFFs. Get her look. Sweet but glam do's and don'ts. <sighs> what is this even saying? I don't follow fashion myself. I usually wear whatever the family stylist selects for me. The her room is way bigger than everybody else's room. Well, I would be open to trying this pink Me and Junpei living in a shoebox, bruh. <sighs> Not that it would suit me anyway. I'm no Takeba. I should remember there's a difference between what appeals to me and what I can actually pull off. Bless you! Good. I bet. I'm going to catch a cold. I should turn in. I have to be up early again tomorrow. Now, which pajamas shall I wear tonight? Why does she even need those couches? Who's she inviting over? That's a good point. I right, no new recordings to say that. <clears throat> oh, there's another uh Ken social link thingy. I'm chilling in my bed. Oh, no, it's because if you didn't do it earlier, you could probably do it now. All right, well, let's go ahead and hope and praise that Academics is the arcade game. Maybe I should just, like, commit to memory, like, which one it is. Wait, it's going to be, it's going to be crowded, isn't it? Yeah, I already did the Monk Guy social link. I have to fucking chill in my bed like a broke boy. I can't afford Pokemon cookies, bro. Fuck. Ambush up. Oh, I guess I, I could have done that. Maybe I should have done that. You use the knowledge netbook? Uh, yes. I used two of them already. Morning. Sup, dude? How you doing? Uh, pretty good. <laughs> Speaking of pokey cookies, I tried them yesterday. Did you like them? Let's own that next shadow and make the world a better place. Yucatan! Hey there. Now, unfortunately, we can't extend the buys our relationship, but it's fine. They were super dry, but with milk, it was I. Okay, gotcha. I kind of, I would have tried her cookies if they were available in like a physical store or if they were on like at least Gold Puff or some shit. Like I'm not finna order them and then have them come in like fucking six years from now type shit. I see you back. Okay, our next operation is going to be on Sunday. So I should go to the Tataris on Saturday. $7 though? If you're a broke boy, just say that. Like... Filling this fire with their burning desire. Alright, let's get our academics up. Hooray! We're so far away from a level up, though. Like, it's actually crazy. I'm gonna be cutting it close, I think, when it comes to November time. Damn, this episode of the playthrough is almost five hours long at this point. We got a couple more days to kill, though. By the way, 
It's finally time to break out the winter coats. Oh shit, it's winter time. You know what? Oh, she's getting apathy syndrome. Stay awake. Give me my free knowledge points. I need a midterm to come up, actually. <laughs> it seems Yukari wants to walk home with me. Yay! Spend time with Yukatan type shit. Was there anywhere you wanted to stop by? Maybe we could get some tea first, then go shopping after. Let's see. I'd like to stop by the drugstore before we head home. Do you mind? It'll just be a little longer. Hang on. I've got a phone call. Oh. Hello? Yeah? What? So, get to the point already. Huh? She wants some perks? You know better than me. That's not funny. What? How do you think that would make Dad feel? Fine. Do whatever you want. Just don't call me again. Sorry. Um. Um. Is that a Yu Yu Hakusho shirt? This is a uh, I'm fine. Satch Bell shirt. Thanks for asking. You know who I was on the phone with, right? Yeah, it was my mom. She says she wants to get remarried. Oh. I don't really care if she wants to get married again. What I can't stand is how she chose to live her life. Running away from things, jumping from guy to guy. Damn! To my dad. She cooking her. Yukari seems pretty upset. Omega definitely not reading off a guy just looking at his phone. I'm actually uh ordering something real quick. I'll never be like her. I'll never give up standing on my own two feet. Running away from your problems by clinging on to others is the worst thing you can do. I've decided I'll make it through on my own. I'll show her that I can be happy that way. Yukari has shared her innermost feelings. I understand her a little bit better now. Yeah, like I've been saying, the social links in Persona 3 are just literally the best of the best. Thanks for listening. For some reason, I feel like I can tell you anything. Let's head back now. I'll do the rest of my shopping some other day. Cool. Hey. Okay, so this is the ambush one, I'm pretty sure. Let me go ahead and read this up. I think this one is the one that does the ambush attack. There's a list of self-defense videos here, each with a detailed text description. I decided to start with the most watched video. I learned the importance of having the will to stand up to an enemy. Maybe I can use what I learned in our fights in Tartarus. You learn how to use ambush. You can now ambush enemies while exploring. When ambushing an enemy, you'll trigger chance encounters regardless of the direction the enemy is facing. Oh. Press and hold RT to dash. I pretty much already do this anyways. By pressing X while in this state, you will ambush the enemy. Triggering an encounter from behind will slightly increase Agimo's theurgy gauge and may distress the enemy. Oh, that's really good. Okay, Saturday, we should head into the Tartarus. Am 
my game just freeze? Wait, my Xbox controller is now fucking up? No shot. What? I thought it was just a Sony controller. What happened? Oh, here we go. Oh, we can hang out with Fuka, chat. <laughs> fucking keyboard up, type shit. Watch me not be able to progress with her. Wait a minute. Fuka, I've judged you too harshly. You're actually a W at the end of the day. Fuka, you know what? I'm going to say it. You're my favorite character in video game history. Let's get you to rank five, shorty. So there's actually something I want you to try. I want you to try something too. Ever heard of Shiho? We are on top of the building after all. I'm kidding. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. And this time, it's just a joke. It isn't just for a taste test. I think oh. you'll actually be able to eat it. You think so? Uh, maybe I said the same thing last time. Well, now I mean it. Fuka presents me with a bento box. There are rice balls wrapped in seaweed inside. They smell good. I decide to try one. It's edible at least. The rice tastes good and it has just the right amount of seasoning. In fact, I'd go as far as to say it's delicious. Well, how is it? Can I say this shit is ass? Really? I'm so glad to hear that. Thank you. You know how I said I was having trouble with cooking? Well, I decided to try and find a recipe that even I couldn't mess up. And after a lot of consideration, I thought maybe making rice balls is something I could handle. But then I got really absorbed in how simple they are to make. Yet still so hard to master. I made some rice balls today in home economics class too. I know it's a little silly to make something so basic in high school, but it was honestly that's W's W I progression. Class told me they were really good though. W progression. Good for you, Fuka. Anyways, I've been really you cannot do the fucking bare minimum. I'm proud of you, Fuka. Yes, I don't think I could have made it this far without you. I'm glad I could help. Thanks. I know I've said this before, but when I'm with you and the rest of the team, I'm able to see things more positively. And I think the most important thing is the feeling of wanting to make others happy. That might be the reason why I made such good rice balls. Because I was thinking about who was going to eat them. Like, Yukari social link. She's got trauma with her mom, drama with her mom. You feel me? Drama with her family. And this bitch is drama. She's making rice balls. Of course. Just let me know anytime you want some. Um, I just wanted to say thank you so much. Really. Fuka seems to really appreciate me. Our relationship is getting deeper. <laughs> Don't gotta deal with mommy issues. So it turns out there's actually a trick to making good rice balls. The first thing to note is while you're washing the rice. Wait, can you continue? I actually kind of wanted to hear that. The full moon's the day after tomorrow. There are only three shadows left. We're almost done, so let's do our best, okay? Um, what do I get for this? Is it courage? Yeah. Now's a bad time, Jit. You ended the recording before or after Tartarus? Before. I think I'm gonna do the Tartarus shit completely off stream. Or off, uh, completely on stream off video. So we're going to do like a couple hours of like pretty much just chilling in the Tartarus, just those girls before we start the, uh, the next little story section. I want to buy P3R on PS5 for a physical disc, but I also want to use Steam due to a Steam deck. Just, see, this is why all you have to do is get a PlayStation portal. 
Now, the worst thing about becoming, uh, about starting to get physical games now is that now I have to become a console gamer. And that's gonna be the fucking worst, man. You know what's crazy? If, if uh, Code doesn't even have a PlayStation Portal, that's how you know it's ass. There's also just something different to owning the game physically. I don't know. Like, I, I like having the game tangibly. Mm, why is that? I cannot explain why, but our highest priority should be eliminating the remaining shadows. The moon will be full tomorrow. I shall accompany you in battle. Pay close attention, all right? Oh, dope. That's going to be huge for my knowledge, actually. Is Yakuza Zero bringing back the airplane jet to the PS4? <laughs> nah, I'm pretty sure you can play it on your PS5, right? You can put PS4 discs in your PS5, surely. Hey there. Yeah, okay, I was about to say. You never know with Sony, man. Like. <laughs> okay, Yukari, you're about to get to rank 5 as well. Switch cases are the worst for physical. I actually think Switch games are like the best games to get physically. Why don't we go someplace else? Because it feels like they're like the only manufacturer or they're the only console that like developers seem to care about putting games physically for or something. Wait, let me see how much money I have. Oh no, where's my wallet? Did I drop it? But when? I had it when I pulled out my train pass. Wait, someone bumped into me outside the station. Sorry, I'm gonna go back there and look around. It'll just take a minute. Make sure you wait right here, okay? I'll be fine, so don't come after me. Um, okay. Stay right there, you got it? Yukari vehemently warned me and ran off. What should I do? You lost your Mario Kart 8? That's why you always put the cartridge back in the case. I'm starting to get weird looks. It doesn't seem she's coming back. Did something happen? I decided to go check up on her. What you say? You better shut your mouth, bitch. <laughs> if you don't behave, you'll lose more than just your wallet. I'll take you on. Huh? Who the hell are you? Her boyfriend. Hey, wait, what are you saying? Um, you really got to brag, huh? Time to beat the shit out of you. Did they jump my ass? Yukari seems appreciative. It seems we've grown closer. That was a little intense, though. You oh, sorry. Hey, why'd you come after me? Didn't I say to wait? Did you think I needed saving? Mm. I'm not helpless, you know? I got my wallet back by myself. I didn't need your help. Uh, you're a girl, so <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't apologize. I should be the one saying sorry and thank you. Type of shit I'm on. I'll just go on ahead. I'm all right now. Sorry again. See I don't think reversing social links is a thing in this game. I think they took that out of this game.
You fumbled this one? Wait, how did you fumble this? Okay, chat. Uh, we have to go to Tartarus today. Oh, whoops. Okay. Check everyone's status. Everyone can go. All right, let's go to Tartarus. It's time. And this episode is going to clock in right at five hours long. Jesus Christ. Hey. Oh, shit. So you're the one that decides the battle formation. I do. I get back into the swing of things as quickly as possible. You get what I'm saying, right? Mm. Noted. All right. This place is just as creepy as I remember. Well, I'm here if you need me. Oh, new Arcana cards? The Hermit Tarot is reacting. Maximum SP will be increased by seven. All right. And this is the team that I'm going to be rocking out with. Main character, Yukari, Koro, and Shinji. And that's what I'm going to be going ahead and grinding. Uh, I think I'm just not going to include any of the Tartarus stuff. So that's going to conclude this episode of the Persona 3 playthrough. Thank you guys for watching. Tune in tomorrow uh, or, or just go to the next video on the playlist or whatever to um, watch the next part where we're going to go ahead and get to the next story segment and uh, and tackle that full moon. All right, boys. Thank you for watching.